Hello there. Hi, welcome. Just getting started with the stream. So, uh, welcome. Uh, thanks for joining. I hope you can actually hear the microphone. Can you hear that? It's only my second time doing this. Can you hear my voice? Whoever is there. If you don't want to reply, that's okay. Um, I'm just getting things going today. So, hopefully you can hear my voice. I'm just going to tweet out that I've started. Be with you in one second. <laughs> okay. Oh, hold on a second. So, right, let's see. How do I get this microphone going? want to check it's working. I'm going to take my headphones off a second just so I can hear it coming through on my computer. Yeah, that's going all right, isn't it? Yeah, that's going all right, isn't it? Okay, great. Super. Huh. Well... I did get asked to stream today again after streaming last week with the vigil and then doing some of the Heavensward journey uh, and now uh, we thought we'd stream again this week and carry on doing that but uh, so maybe there are some people that are coming I don't know obviously there was a lot more people last week Let's get to Falcon's Nest and get ready. Okay. So, this is. I guess most people. I mean, gosh, I'm not sure what most people do. They probably just say a few welcomes. But I haven't really got. You know, I'm very new to all of this, so this is me getting on with it and just having a little go. I can't quite to ah, there you go. That looks like a place I've got to get to. Hello, who else have we got joining us? I've got a couple of people. That's kind of you. Thanks for coming along. I am just uh, getting started. Trying to figure out where I'm going to go. I will. I won't. I will wait a minute or two before I start the quest. Hello, thanks for coming back, Gravy Bun Flux. It's lovely to see you. You know, you know, metaphorically, <laughs> seeing you here. Yeah, I'm doing okay, thank you very much. How are you doing? Have you had a good week? I managed to get to um, the coast to stay in um, a caravan or I mean depending on where you come from you might call them a trailer near the beach uneventful but good ah uh, well you know that is what we can mostly hope for isn't it an event you know as long as it's been good that's uh, <laughs> even if it was uneventful is sometimes very good indeed um, I'm hoping this is going to go okay today. I seem to have the microphone working from the off first time again, so that's good, unlike my test last Monday. What have you been playing this week? Have you been playing games while well, I've been I've been away? I, this, I haven't played anything until... I played some things on Sunday, so I played something yesterday, but after last Monday, I didn't... Uh, 
I didn't get to play any games while I was away in the caravan. So all these things just little right, I can't remember what I'm gonna to have to do. Let's check back on the journal what I've got to do. Roth is convinced that Erin Icicle Sprites residing in the Hamlet are causes of recent delays. <coughs> Keep watch for the sprites and slay them if they appear. Okay, so that sounds quite straightforward. Let's go and slay some icicle sprites. See how we get on. See how far I have to go before we get to hear the count. Because of course, oh hello, I sense the hostile presence. Okay, oh that's the wrong one. It's quite lovely how Peanut is ready to join me a whole week later. We're still 17 minutes on the clock. <laughs> Hello everybody, thanks for joining in. It's lovely to have have some of you back to to join in this little journey of mine. Through Heavenswood and, you know, and side quests, etc. But, um... So you've you've got on with some uh, some quests. What have you? I, I wouldn't ask what you've been slacking on because it might be far ahead of this. I guess I'm guessing because you know this is like seven and eight year old content now, isn't it? That I'm on another hostile presence. Hello, Hopsy. How lovely of you to join. Oh, that's so great. This, this is not my experience of high school, people coming back to see me a week later. This is lovely, a lovely difference. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Drazan! Well, I've only just started. So, you know... I am just here myself, really, a few minutes ago. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Stormblood content you didn't get around to. I have all that to look forward to. I mean, I've still, I must still have some little side quests from the Realm Reborn stuff that I haven't done. Hmm, maybe. Oh, we've got to go up. Oh, I've got to go up. How do I go up here? Oh, that'll be the steps, Rob. Up the steps. Hello to those of you joining in, I'm Rob, I'm the Poet Plays, and here we are, we're going to do some more of Heavensward. Oh, hello, goodbye. I don't know how it works, these numbers keep popping up and down. It's going to be very different than last week, of course, because we had the, the vigil, so we had lots of people coming for that. going to be uh, very lucky to have people here. Three icicle sprites this time. Whatever will I do? Thank you, Peanut. I've searched the Falcon's Nest for icicle sprites. Report to Roth, who is over here somewhere. Oh, maybe down the steps. I have a lovely voice. That's very kind of you. I'm sure I, I'm sure most of the people here have lovely voices. It's just we're all on you're all on text, so I can't hear you. That might be a bit overbearing, wouldn't it? Watching and having lots of voices at the same time. But that's very sweet of you. Thank you. I did used to work as a voice a voiceover artist, so um, I used to earn money off my voice, and I'd like to do that again. Roth says, ha, now there's a woman what looks like she's found her marks. <laughs> a very calm voice. Well, that's because I'm having a good time. When my anxiety hits, then it doesn't get too calm. But Gaming helps with the anxiety, hey, so it's good. You're just the sort we need around here, says Roth. The kind that'll opt to when she sees a task undone. Oh, all right. 
what shall I have? Um, do I want any of these for my... Actually, I'm just going to take the money and run. Take the money and run. Does everybody been having a good week? I think Grab Bunflux has said they they uneventful but good. The first and foremost we're going to do now, so that's one quick quick quest done. Here we go on the next one. Good help is hard to find. A sad truth that Roth knows well. You started having anxiety attacks a couple of years ago. I hope they're not too um, severe and too frequent for you, Hopso, because I've been having them for over 20 years, and last year it got very bad indeed. Um, but the last couple of months I've not been doing too bad, thankfully. Uh, it's horrible when they come and they just... Uh, yeah, you don't know what's going on, do you, really? You don't know why you feel like that, and uh, it's really hard. But I've had some... I've been lucky enough to find a really good therapist who I've been seeing for about a year now, who I see once a week. And she has been a great, great help. So I recommend that if you if you manage to. You, you've taken uh, propranolol help with migraines and anxiety. You're very grateful. It can be hard. To, yeah, I have what they call a drug-resistant brain, which is weird. Tell that to me in the 90s, and that would have been different. But So I can't take anxiety medication. It actually makes things worse. So that's annoying. So I'm very happy for everybody that, that does manage to get benefit out of it. Oh, getting stuck in your apartment. That's hard. Yeah, I've been a little bit like that. But hopefully you have contact with people. So, And being here this evening, you've got... Uh, there's, um, you know, a few people here that we can all chat to. So we're all together, which is a really good boost to anxiety, isn't it? Now, what's Roth saying? You're a dab hand at Warcraft, I can tell. Not that I have any skills at arms to speak of mine, but it doesn't take an expert to recognise expertise. Very good. Um, everybody's still okay with me doing stupid voices for the parts because I will probably just keep doing that. It's getting me, getting me hand back in. What are those? Are those lovely little? I can't see. You know, I can't see on my screen. They are. That's a beautiful emoji, isn't it? I love that. Is that like a fox or a cat? Or is that specifically something that I should know but don't understand? <laughs> They're beautiful anyway. I love those emojis. Um, Roth, be a waste to keep you to myself when there are others out there out what need help, same as me. So if you're keen to keep on doing what you've done, I'd ask you to head north to the pike, the bloody huge statue out in the waste. If you've never been, it's a fox. Great, love foxes. Mason, by the name of Tiermont, is out there tending to the thing. Good man, Tiermont, but I reckon he's taken on too much work for one. Might be there's something you can do for him. It might be. Hope so, otherwise we're all going to be really bored watching me do nothing. Right, whereabouts is he? Is he way out here? I've got to go out there. Travelling out. Which way is out? Do I go down? Yeah, it's something comforting, isn't there, about uh, being inside a space you feel you can control, I think. Um, but, uh, well, you feel more in control of. Not necessarily that you can control, but you feel more in control of. And um, I, also, I, I also have ADHD and uh, I'm on the autistic side. So sometimes I get very overwhelmed by things look at you all sending hugs to each other I love this community Final Fantasy pe 14 people are so adorable you've all made me feel very welcome indeed I suppose I should be running to see what's going on over here what's a deep eye? oh stay too long now I'm gonna find out what a deep eye is <laughs> never look a deep eye in the eye obviously
You're looking at me, he says. And that's it. Oh, and the other one's joined in. It's like a pub brawl. I was minding my own business, just admiring your shape, you guys. Or trying to figure out what the hell you are. Looks like a bird. Oh, I just killed so cute little birds. Oh dear. Whoops. Ah. Well, this is nice. Oh, it's a little bit cold, but it's like, oh my goodness me. It fits in with the snowy setting, I suppose, of being cold in my house. Oh, hello. Here we go, here we go. Stranger this week, of course, for me, because last week we had, you know, a beautiful couple of hours all talking about Stephen Critchlow, Count Edmund, and all that amazing paying of respects people were doing and sharing of campfire minions going on um, outside the manor and that was really beautiful so I wasn't really playing the game and getting started straight away but I thought maybe I should just get on with it today here's Tiamon what do you reckon Tiamon sounds like hail to you traveller what brings you out this way Foreman Roth bid you assist me well far be it from me to turn down a helping hand Oh, hello, Rando. Welcome back. Thanks for joining. It's really lovely to have you here. So, what are you saying? All, all mobs outside of a few optional content are areas uh, detect you via sight. So, if you go around them, they don't see you. They won't aggro. See, I thought initially, and I was obviously mistaken, that they seem to all just ignore me if you were more than five or six levels above them. But now in this content, it seems to not do that. But it seems to do that if you're just in... Gridania or Limpsa or whatever, so around those, you know, Thanalan and all that. But what did it say? Well, far be it from me to turn down a helping hand. I've been tasked with the restoration of this sculpture. Five years of neglect of not being kind, to say the least. Fortunately, I've just the thing for it. Rather, those deep eyes have it. Ah, if you could slay three and bring me their bristles, I would be in your debt. I've just killed four. Okay. <laughs> Go find some more. There's one. Oh god, there's tons in the minimap. Look at them. Bring me their bristles, the poor things. Get a few bristles going on. Oh, their radius of detection gets smaller as your level goes higher. Oh, that makes sense. Well, I am level 60 and they're level 50, so they're not ignoring me. Maybe it's because they're part of the quest. I don't know. I don't make the rules. We'll just play the game and see what happens. There's certainly not going to be too much problem for me, are they? They might make it. Hurt me a little. But... I'm pretty sure I'm going to be okay. There we go. That's three. Let's go back. It's ever so nice, isn't it, when you're doing a quest and everything drops things straight away for you instead of going and hunting for an hour. Please. There you are. Have you the bristles? Yes, I do. It says here, though they look very much like animal hide. Thumbs up, Tiamon. Thank you. Ah, I feel how coarse that is. That's why they're perfect for scrubbing the soot from this statue. I'm not going to start scrubbing. It's beautiful, isn't it? The spitting image of Haldrath, first of the Azure Dragoons and one of Ishgard's founding fathers. A symbol of everything the Dravanians despise, which is why they've taken to searing it with dragonfire every time they pass by. Oh, I see what you're saying there, Drazan. May technically plus 
10 means it have to be 61. Uh, that's not going to happen. I'm still on the trial. I am gated at level 60. But no longer will we suffer this des desecration of our nation's hero. Soon this statue will be as it once was, a proud, shining testament to the determination of Isgard and a message to the heretics that we have returned. The work may be hard and the conditions harsh, but as a proudest guardian I could ask for no greater honour. Oh, that's good. A rainbow robe of aiming? Well, that seems to be nice. What is that? Oh, that's item level 5 and defense. Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? I should probably get that. Don't want any of those. Not as of the bard. I have zero slots remaining in my inventory. Oh dear. I did no housekeeping. <laughs> I did no housekeeping. There's probably no slots in... Oh gosh. In my armory either. What's that? I don't need that. Oh, that's something I needed to get rid of. Uh, mm. <laughs> do I look like a hoarder? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, I hadn't thought about that. What are these? No, that. No, where is it then? Man, da, da, da. Ah, c'est là! Hello, Balthazar. I'm doing very well. I hope you're doing very well. How lovely to, to see you here too. Thank you very much for joining. I hope you've had a good day. Uh, it's 20 past 7 here where I am. I'm sure it's varying times all over the place. You're a hoarder too. Yes. Yeah, they're all... Oh, I don't have retainers. That's a, that's a luxury I don't have either. Oh, look, I have some spare slots that I can get rid of some stuff in. I should probably sell things, but I keep forgetting. And then if I keep selling them, then my gill goes to over 300,000 and I can't get above 300,000. So... <sighs> Can't give things away. Can't do it. Either. Can't do it at all. What have I got? See, I keep thinking I'll keep these seeds for when I'm allowed. When I get the full game, <laughs> and I can um, find, you know, try and find a free company and plant them. But um, that seems a bit stupid of me, really. I'm sure I could find some more tomato seeds. Does everybody who's watching? You're all, you're all players of the game, aren't you? So you all got houses and do gardening and stuff <laughs> inventory yeah inventory issues that's a polite way of pointing it isn't it inventory issues I have an inventory issue does everyone else have an inventory issue yes I do uh, what was I doing this is a trouble with ADHD uh, what was I doing I was changing my robe and this one oh I can't have any um, oh, what on earth is that? It looked like Robin Hood. Robin. Robin. Da -da -da -dum. Oh, yeah, very relaxed. I look there with my great mask and my. Oh. It's like a bat insignia on there. Um, what shall we put on this then? I do believe. I need to put some of these on. Oh, it's nice to use them. Um, if I remember rightly, this is good. Direct hit rate. Somebody will say no in a minute. Don't put that on. Don't put that on. That's useless, Rob. Don't do that. Um, oh, calm atmosphere while you cook. It's a star. Is it a star or is that like um, Twitch asterisking out? <laughs> it's a star. Oh well, that's <laughs> that's sweet. I just cooked for my obviously because I couldn't cook any do this at the same time. I hope you have something nice. Savage might or savage aim? Which one shall I put on? One does determination. One does critical hit. Oh, who cares? That one. It's all better than none. And then, what I've tempted to do is put one of the level 1 ones on, because the chance of melding is higher. 
and apparently it helps with the uh, spirit bond I'm told so that's nice it helps speed up the spirit bond the more things you have melded so I'm told by people with greater knowledge than me there we go so that's a bit weird it's very minimal yeah it's a cap for the substack yes I've seen those and it says no you can't have four determination you can only have two or you can have zero but it is true that the, the spirit bond goes up so that's good um, although as we've seen from my inventory I have a few too many <laughs> I was trying to get a piety one from my mage for a quest but hey we'll get back on that do you know, I tried desperately to get my um, little profile image that I have on Twitch and on Twitter of me in the silly face to appear on the channel on this, this because I'm streaming from PlayStation uh, to appear in the top right. But no, it's still Aloy. We have Aloy with us again. So Aloy is coming along for the journey through Heavenswood as well, it would seem. Okay, Tiamon, what am I doing? Before you return to Falcon Nest, Tiamon has a favour to ask. Are you for Falcon's Nest? If so, I have a favour to ask. Just said that, Tiamon. Uh, that makes sense for, for, for Hunky. For, for Hunky. Is that right? For Hunky? Hi again. Thank you. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome along. Thanks for being. So if it's got crit on it, it's usually better to add something else. That makes sense. You see, now I've been doing it probably the other way of adding the same thing again until it says, no, you can add no more. But um, again, I'm early in the game, aren't I? And it doesn't really matter. As you, as uh, Jason was saying, it's a minimal amount of extra. Tiamon, there's this knight, Sir Isidore, stationed at the anvil to the west of here. She's always treated me with kindness and respect more than I deserve, to be honest. I believe you. Any road, while you were away, she came through on patrol. I wasn't away, I've been stood here. She came through on patrol, and I think she might have left a package behind. Sounds like an Amazon delivery. It's a bit of a detour, but would you mind returning it to her? My thanks to you, friend. Direct hit and crit tends to be the most popular common stats for DPS. Ah. Huh. Some minor deviation into determination and skill speed for some of the others. DPS. Is that what I put on? I can't even remember what I put on. Direct hit and determination. Look at me. I did the determination. Ah, uh, savage might instead of savage aim. Makes sense now. Oops. Never mind. Oh. See, so much rabbiting on... Peanut disappeared. Come back, Peanut. All is forgiven. I can get used to saying that. It's quite makes me chuckle. Come back, Peanut. Come back, Peanut. Where am I going? Bard is DPS. Yes, I have gathered that much. I have not. You know, I've not even tried playing a tank yet. Two hundred fifty hours. Haven't played tank. Got many more hours to go before I work. Oh dear. That's down. Oh, hello. Don't know if I'm going the right way. Oh, seems to be. Are you up there? If I've got to get up there. Looks, looks like he's up there. Oh, what do you want now? Who's this? Steinbock. Oh, ow. I say, old Jack Steinbock. That was a bit rum. Minding my own business, and now you want me to take a slice off your flank. Bad choice. Of course, I've got no space in my inventory, have I? Give them anything. If they give me. Oh, this does not appear to be the way. How do I get where they are? Oh, hold on. I've lost it. Where's it gone? There. How do I get there? They appear to be up there. Hmm. Does not appear to be this way. Did you misunderstand? I don't know if you did. You're not backseating. 
I don't think talking about some little technical aspects of it is backseating, is it? Unless you were telling me something completely that I didn't know. It's alright, Darzan. Thank you very much for... Well, I've got to find my way around somehow. I think I've... I've, I've I'm almost convinced I've figured out Limsa now. <laughs> ah, up here. There's a chocolate boat. Yeah, there's who I need to speak to. Hello. Isador. Hello. What's that? A package? I have the foggiest what you're talking about. Oh, it's this package. It's an ice crusted bundle. Confound it, that fool of. <sighs> what a waste. What is she talking about? It was a gift adventure. Tim on Labour's Day, a night without regard for his own well being. At the very least, he ought to try to eat better. Oh. Why not simply give it to him? By the fury, have you no sense of decorum? A highborn knight cannot be seen favouring a lowborn mason in such a manner. Nevertheless, I appreciate your concern as well as your willingness to assist Tiermon. May your journey back to Falcon's Nest be safe and swift. Pray give my regards to Sir Redwald. Okay. Fair enough. Sling your rook, she says. Oh, if only I could fly. Oh, I can't fly. If only I could fly. Oh. Can't fly. Oh. Can you hear that lovely little bit of laid back bass playing there? What do you all want? Go away. I've got stuff to do. I don't mean you lot. <laughs> Listening, watching, obviously. I mean those stein box with their pointless attacks. Oh, a nice little flap on a strange... I can't even remember what this is. What is it called? The eye? It's the strange eye thing, isn't it? Pondering face emojis says funky. Pondering thinky face. Wondering what the hell I'm doing. And well you may. I don't know what I'm doing. In this bit? In here? Where is it? Oh, I seem to be going in the right direction. Ariman. Okay, I don't know what that means. What does that mean? <laughs> Redwald! I must applaud your initiative, Mr. Sestaya. Roth tells me you've been quite busy. Alas, we have not the time to thank you properly. I have a task to which I would commit all able-bodied men and women, you and Lord Artoriel included. It's a classic FF monster. Is that what the winged eyeball is? Ariman. Oh, yes, now I understand. Thank you, Rando. Um, you see, because I've only obviously probably come across it a couple of times then they got the mount and then haven't done that dungeon or whatever again so I forget things very easily quest complete Redworld what have you for me to do now are we going to get any closer to Edmont so when I finished the to stream last week, last Monday, um, people were saying that it was about an hour and a half through this quest line before I might get to see him. So maybe we get Edmont in about an hour. I'd love to hear Stephen's voice in the game again. I only had that first little bit of clip and then a little um, intro where he welcomes everybody. Inventory is full again. Did it just do that? Did I just have my inventory full again? Arse. Threadle's glad to have veterans like you to whom he can turn. Stupid people who carry too many things around. <laughs> That's what he wants. Is there anybody we can get who has no space in their inventory to help us? Yes, let's get Lana. 
she'll come along. Um, calm as ever, even when you must surely sense the gravity of the situation. A veteran through and through, just as Lord Drillmont said, good. We have lost contact with the reconnaissance parties, head north to Rivers Meet in search of the heretic's hideaway. Whether they were attacked or met with some other misfortune, we know not. But regardless of the cause, we must act quickly, for this is a harsh, unforgiving land which can claim and has claimed the lives of many men. To ensure we find our missing knights as quickly as possible, I have assigned each party a different area to search. You and Lord Artoirel... Is that how you say it? That's how I'm saying it anyway. Lord Artoirel will be working together. Seek him out when you're ready to depart, and good luck. Thank you very much. No, it's not quite full, my chocobo saddle bag. I should put something in. I shouldn't have whatever that piece of meat is there. I sh that should be gone. <laughs> Discard. I don't need the coins, because I can't have any more coins. I'll get them anyway. Look at all this stuff. What have I got it all for? Iron ore? I mean, that's like so cheap. Why am I carrying that? Go away. Don't need that. I should have done it before. <laughs> before playing the game on here and putting the stream on, shouldn't I, really? Because, you know, nobody wants to watch me. Oh, why have I got those? Oh, really? Two extra? I thought I had loads of silver pieces. I thought I had them all at the back here. I thought I had... Oh, it's because I've gone over 99. I've got, see, I've got, I've been storing them up for when. <laughs> I can't have retainers yet, Funky, because I'm on the trial. It is a restriction that I'm not allowed, as well as the marketplace and my 3,000 gil limit and not being able to have a house and all that sort of crap. So no retainers for me. No, not yet. Um, yeah, look, I've got 99 of those. That's, so that's, you know. 50,000 extra gil. Do I really need to keep them? <laughs> As if it's going to make a massive difference when I finally can. I'll get, oh, another 60,000 gil to add on to my... So there's people... I saw somebody today. It is annoying, but, you know, I'm not quite a cheapskate. I just haven't got very much money. And there's loads of content. It just is the restrictions that you can't do those things that are probably very helpful. But this is also why... Um, I do. So sorry, Rando, coming away from my saddlebag. This is also why I have um, all of these so heavily, like almost maxed out for where I am, um, because I couldn't have the market board. So you know, I couldn't buy anything. I had to level people up to make them when I needed to make them, and go and mine things and dig things up and chop at trees and all that crap and do fishing. Fishing was really easy to level up actually. We were very easy indeed. That was very easy to level up. Hello Shy, how are the cats? Are uh, they as those little kittens were absolutely adorable. If you haven't if you're not following Shy on Twitter then you should. Uh, there's this beautiful beautiful little video they posted uh yesterday I think um that um of their little kittens. Oh, they're adorable. They are wonderful, yeah. So are you for everything you did for everybody last week. All those minions that you made for everyone, that's brilliant. Oh, I keep hitting the 300k limit, Hopsa, all the time, and then forgetting about it, and then going, oh, I'll just go and buy some more Gashel Greens or something, but I've got nearly a thousand of those. So. <laughs> or go and buy some equipment, which I've done a few times for some of the other classes. But then I end up with a stupidly full armory, so this is just no good, is it? Like this. Got no space. Hoarder next door, they call me. I really need to organise it. That won't be a streaming thing, though. Hmm. Well, everybody just sit here for 45 minutes while I try and figure out what I do and don't need in my inventory and armory. That'll be the dullest stream I could possibly do. Your little babies are funny little sillies. They are very funny. <laughs> flapping. Did I see the video of the little boy flapping his flirt at me? Yes, I did. I loved that. And I shared that with my daughter and with my wife. And they absolutely adored it. And what, what Shy means is the little video, tiny kitten, 
having some uh, milk from its mum and then wanting some attention from its cat mama, which is shy, and um, <laughs> having some attention, and then turning and forgetting that it wasn't milking anymore, and its tongue's just flicking around. It's adorable. Go follow Shia on Twitter right now and find the video. It's only uh, the other day. You'll see it. You, Popster says we can help you on cleaning the inventory if by any chance you need help with it. Do you know, I probably do. Yes. Maybe I'll do that on Thursday. That'll be a highlight of Thursday evening for me. I thought, oh yeah, I thought I'd stream. Uh, oh, you might have seen it. I oh, know yeah, you probably haven't seen it. Why would anybody able have a look? I did a little preliminary schedule of when I'm going to stream. So that's on my about page on underneath the video. So you can have a look. He wasn't sure if he wanted to eat or flirt. And you fell apart. <laughs> he's really an amusing little bugger, yeah. He's adorable. I, I will watch that again later. It will cheer me up immensely. Hello to everybody that's here. It's so lovely. I'm really... Yeah. I'm really touched that you've come back to join me on my little journey. Oh, you don't use Twitter that much? Hey, you don't have to use it to go and have a little look at the kitten. <laughs> um, can I... Am I allowed, Shy, to share a link to the video? Oh, I've got to find it. Is that okay? Because I don't know how to let other people link to the video or share links on here. I don't know how that works. Bum, 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 shy on uh, well, you know, I mean, just go to twitter.com slash shy on Twitch. It's the same. Um, it is public, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's it's there. Oh no, let's find it, because I want to share this video, because it's so damn cute. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's find that classy content, this, from me now, look. Sharing Twitter on Twitch. Um, where is this? Oh, it's your, it's your yeah, it's a highlighted one, there it is, it's right there. I'm getting there, folks, here it comes. So there's the thing. There it is. So there we've got. Oh, for Hunky, what? That. <laughs> uh, that. I, d I don't really quite know what to say to to that. Um, I, I would have to pay the sub. That's a good point, Rando. Yeah, I ha I would have to pay the sub, and I still haven't figured it figured it out. That's. Oh. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I. Um, that's a very kind and generous offer. I'm also, I'm not on PC, I'm on PlayStation. I'm on a Canada server. Canada server, what am I on? Canada region for some reason. Well, everybody knows the region, of course. I've got various accounts on my PlayStation, like everybody, because people, I've, I've uh, entered competitions on Twitter to win games. I'm still stuck in the same place. I haven't done anything with the game, have I? We're just chatting. I like that, just chatting. Just a little bit of chat. Um, I think because I've had... Um, oh, you, you lot will know better than me. But because I've started a free trial already, you don't get the free 30-day period when you buy one of the others. You've got to go straight into subbing. I believe. I mean, you know. You've seen the kitties now. Um, but, you know, um, that's very sweet of you. Let's um, I, 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 well, uh, let's talk some more, maybe off the stream or, you know, send me a message or something. But I don't know how quite to do it. Cause I, haven't, I was saying I haven't figured out how I actually do upgrade to the proper one and keep it all working. You still get the 30 days. Oh, oh well, that's quite good. Maybe that would be nice. Yeah. Oh. Well, let's do this. Let's do this thing and talk more. I'm, uh, you know, um, I'm here. Oh, look, look, Lana's so bored of me now. She's just puffing cold air, hands behind her back. Let's talk to Artuarel. <sighs> look, you can tell I'm a bit overwhelmed with the kindness, can't you? I'm just going to do the game for a bit. <laughs> Artuarel, what sort of voice do we have him? He's going to be posh like his brother. It seems we have been assigned the area near Camp Riversmeet, Mistress Sestaya. Quite a young chap, isn't he? 
I know. Lest you are unaware, the camp was one of many our knights were forced to abandon when we withdrew from the Curthless Western Highlands, one of many sacrifices made in the wake of the Calamity. I could also hold off on adding the key until I'm ready. I don't think you can on PlayStation. You can on um, you can on PC, of course, though, if it was on Steam or wherever else you want to play it. Um, but with the PlayStation, you um, you buy it and it's immediately just upgraded straight away. Apparently, I did look a little bit on Reddit about that. Is that nearly what his actual voice is? Well, we'll find out later. Oh dear. I don't want to be trying to suggest that I'm, <clears throat> you know, I'm not going to try and mimic anyone because that would be terrible. And everybody I do is going to, they're just not going to sound the same because I'm not actually putting a huge amount of effort in. Um, one of the many sacrifices made in the wake of the calamity. It would not surprise me if our knights took shelter there. There is but one way to find out, though. Let us be off. Oh, oh all right, bye. I can't follow you yet. I can now. And you've disappeared. Where do I go? How far away is he? How far? Where? Oh, gosh, all the way out there. There isn't another. I haven't got anything to. No, nothing attuned out there. So let's go. On the, oh, hello. Who's this? This is a friend. This is a friendly friend. I. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Organ, I need to do a hello. Um, how do I do this? I do uh, blush. Hello. <laughs> hello. How lovely is that? Uh, uh, I can't remember. So this is one of the people that was with us. This is Organa Dorthal, who was with us um, last week. Um, hi, Nemesis Rosa. Hi, hello, welcome, come, welcome along. You were there, yeah. Is this you in the game now? I can't tell. I don't, you know. I d uh, and I don't have a keyboard. That's you. Ah, oh, that helps. That helps stopping me from trying to figure out how to do, how to do this and getting the keyboard out and doing all that chat. Because I, f I forgot. Shy told me last week, or somebody told me I should get a Bluetooth keyboard, and I've got one upstairs that I use with a tablet occasionally. And um, I can use a Bluetooth keyboard with my PlayStation, can't I? Uh, <clears throat> uh, yes, the base game. Then oh, I can't. I just, I've missed some bits of the chat. Have I sorry. Um, yeah, uh, you get the starter version, and then you buy Endwalker. That's right, shy. And all this expansions come with it eventually. Yeah, yeah. Um, so that's what I guess. That's what I could do. Yeah, and then. You're telling me I would have these, um... I could just offload everything, couldn't I? I could just... Hello! Um, I like that dress, that's beautiful. I could just then offload everything to one of those retainers and then forget about them forever and then be... <laughs> fully, fully, uh... Look at that dress, isn't it fabulous? Um, I'm not really doing much, am I? What should I do? How do we emote? Where are all my emotes? Oh, there. Hello. Oh, that's that was a bit rude. I bowed right through you then. <laughs> right. Well, um, uh, you're welcome to join me as I go off and. Oh, I've got my unicorn. Uh, join me as I go off and try and find which way out I go. Is it down there? Must be down here. How do I get out here? Ah, that looks like some steps. See, I'm stupid to hop to. It is more than the complete edition, yeah. But um, someone hops to. Um, who was it? Funky, very kindly. For Hunky. Was saying they'd they'd buy me. Ah, oh, come along, Nimsis Rosa. Uh, would um, would like to buy me the Star Tradition. That's very sweet. Are oh, you saw? Oh, please don't. Oh, that that. I mean, you know, you're all very very kind. I mean.
Have I come the wrong way? I've gone to the... Now you're being over... Ah, that's a big hole. I can't get down there. How do I get down here? Oh, that one. You're being very sweet, the lot of you. This is very kind of you. Ow! Ah, oh, they're always attacking me. Let's get them. Can you join me? Yay! Oh, this is... Lo oh. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, somebody kicks ass, don't they, with their character. That's a one hit. Pet stuff is expensive, isn't it? We had some rats for a while, and even rats were too expensive to... Um, too expensive to do the thing on. You could set up a donate button. I don't know how that works. You're level 90. Yeah, well, you know, that's because you've got... Is that a Shiba? Is it a Shiba in you? Is that like, that type of dog? Uh, it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely adorable. Um, one of our neighbours has one of those. Yeah, you can't have kittens without flea treatment and deworming. That's no good. Right, who are we talking to? Um, apart from all of yourselves, I'm talking to Isador. She peers over the cliff with concern. It's a Sheba mount. Um, I, I, as I say, I have no idea how to do the donate thing. That's very kind of you, but um, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm getting bashful now, can you tell? Um, I'm going to do some voices. Some ways beyond here lies Camp Riversmeet. The camp was once the centre of luscious pastures, a prime grazing field for cattle and other livestock. Now it's home to naught more than wolves. Pray help drive the beasts away with sword and spell. Slay three silver wolves. Let them learn to fear us. That's very, very sweet of you, Hopsit. Very sweet indeed. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that. Oops, ow. Oh, it's okay. Which way do we go? Where where do we find these silver things? Well, um, yeah, that, I mean, that would be very kind and generous of you. I would, I, you know, I'd love... Ow! I would love to, um have the full game and play the full game that would be great oh no you've got to buy it on playstation so i don't know how that works either who's this so hello there's somebody else uh oh hello oh gosh you've got so many cute mounts that's amazing um where am i going oh there i've got to oh no i've got to kill some people things first I see you're doing nothing. What are you doing, Artuariel? Yeah, you buy the game and then it immediately, um, uh, you know, registers straight away. And then I'd have to go to the um, Mog Station, would I, and get the sub when it was time? No, it's not. You, 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 it just sends you on a link, I think, to PlayStation if you say if you want to try and get the thing on there. Oh, I'm. Whoa! I cannot go jump down there. Yeah, Canadian region. Stupidly, I did it because I set up this new account with this username, and then I was playing it on there. Join your party, sure. How do I do that? I just click yes. Hey! Now what happens? New adventure, return of a met. Oh, oh hello! <laughs> Nipsis Rosa has all the flash mounts. Uh, yeah, you see, this is another one of my concerns, Drazan, is would that be a uh, conflict with my European. Um, Square Enix account? I'm so scared I might have screwed the whole thing up. Imagine playing for 250 hours and then going, oh by the way you can't carry on this unless you move to Canada. It's a slightly expensive game choice isn't it?
It's a really stupid, pointless. That's a multi-person mound. So I could have got in Nymph Destroza's car. Or Omega car. Oh look, there's now four of us. Oh no, three of us and Peanut. They were going to give me a ride? See, I know nothing. Okay, what do I do? I get in there. Oh, but look, there's a wolf over there. We can go for a ride in a minute. Let's kill these wolves. I'd love to go for a ride in your car. It looks amazing. It looks, is it like the one from uh, Final Fantasy XIV? Is that what it is? Who knows if it's better or worse now? Oh, the dollar amount? Oh, God. The British pound is tanked today because of our stupid government. Yeah, it's the one from Final Fantasy XV. The one that you sit in for like an hour at a time moving from one place to the next. <laughs> in Final Fantasy XV. I've played Final Fantasy XV. I really liked it, Final Fantasy XV, um, but I did find the... Oh, you must now travel here and you must go in your car and then it takes seven minutes. So if I get in, how do I get in? How do I get in? I mean... Do I click on it? How do I, how do I get in? I'm such, such a sprout, aren't I? I know nothing. Target you. Press square. Oh, there you are. Press square. Ride pillion. Mount seats three. Oh! <laughs> what? Look at that! Let's take a picture. What the hell? Where are we going? I had... I had no idea. Oh, right. Now that's fancy. That I like that very much. And who have we got? Who have we got with us? Who who am I talking? Who's here? This is Veskira Veskira Althea. So hi. I should say hi. I got myself a taxi. <laughs> a taxi in the game. Hello. I am... Um, oh, look at that! Do you know, I actually think I'm blushing from the... from the... Uh, kindness. You can't see me though. I might get... Oh, hello. I might get a camera at some point. Or set up one, rather. But then that requires lots of other business. So, let's talk to Isadora. You've already slain those horrid wolves? Yes, yeah, so we had a little sidetrack in a little visit... little drive in a car, but we're back. You have my deepest thanks. Oh, is that you, Gravity Bone Flux? Oh, look at that. There was a time when there were Ishgardian troops stationed at Camp Riversmeet. Should we recover the camp? Were we able to station... Should we recover the camp? Were we able to station soldiers there again? It would make our patrols safer. Let them cover more area. Sounds right. It would be nice to see my real-time reactions to the story. Oh, well, it might be. It might be terrible. You'd see my ludicrously long hair and balding head. That would be funny in itself. Before long, we shall move to reclaim the camp. When that come, time comes, I may call upon your services again. You'd certainly see my flushed face now, which is a surprise considering it's only like 15 degrees centigrade in my house tonight. Ah, it's cold. Before long, we shall move to reclaim the camp. When that time comes, I may call upon your services again. You love watching new players' reactions. Well, I'm guessing there's quite a few people I'm discovering love watching new players play the game because you've all played these things before. You've gone through. Oh, who's like? Who's, is you, you fainted. You fainted. What do we need to do? Well, I think we we need to um um. Um, I don't know. Neil, check you out. Hmm. Yes. Not breathing. Don't know what to do. Uh, face palm. Oh. Comfort. Clap. No, not clap. Clap. <laughs> Comfort. You just patted the air. Lana, what are you doing? 
you patting oh everybody's just oh I don't even know and now you've got no clothes on what are you doing everybody what are we doing where are we going where do we go now follow Atwarel to the cliffs overlooking camp to Riversmeet can we have our snazzy ride again is that is that possible they're playing dead yeah I don't know how to do that it's time to show a trick playing dead okay go on then play dead I can't do that can I because I'd have to have snagging oh hello <laughs> it's an online store remote ah fair enough shall we um shall we take your well-dressed selves um <laughs> old dresses back on um, oh hello yeah look at that you knew what i was asking where's my taxi <laughs> off we go hello we're going that way oh yeah we go that way okay where to we go into wherever that is over there but ever so far <laughs> <laughs> It's over there. <laughs> uh, so far, so far. Oh, that is fancy. I bet that car costs a few dollars in the in the store, huh? There, below us, Camp Rivers Meet, or what remains of it. Don't know if that voice is the same. Oh, thank you very much for the lift. I see no way to descend the cliff safely from here. I do. Someone else can make us go in the car. Should we fall, the beasts below would make short work of us. No, they're all level 90. They'd kick their ass. Come, I know a path to the riverbed below, east of the Black Iron Bridge. Oh, that's a special reward. Oh, wow. Unobtainable moment. Part of that is gone never to be seen again not real money got to just get on the game and do it when it was out yeah I see a bit like this weird minion that I've got that came out with the the um, anniversary thing the other week well you don't know how to go oh off he goes follow him should we follow on foot or are we going to be cheats when is the real question I don't know what the real question is. It could come back either as another rerun. When is the? Re <laughs> I misunderstood what you were saying. <laughs> and now I'm not the headphones off my head. <laughs> when is the real question? I thought you were waiting for the real question from me. <laughs> but now I know what you're talking about. I've got myself all wrapped up. I've got these Bluetooth headphones, but they don't do Bluetooth to the PlayStation, so I'm plugged into the controller. <laughs> Took a lot of years for the first rerun. Yeah, I bet it did. Should we run? We're running past the Steinbach. How far do we have to go? Oh, only there. Are you up here? No, you're on the side of this path. What's that? I've got some weird wizarding kind of candle that you're riding. What the hell is that? Fancy shit going on here. Atwaral, what have you got to say for yourself? If the reconnaissance... Oh, tongue twister. If the reconnaissance party came this way, I see no sign of it. Oh, crossover with Nier. Oh. They've got the um, anime coming out next year, haven't they? No, I can't do that. They have to know loads of stuff. Loads of stuff I can't do. It is possible that recent storms have obscured their trail or that they took an alternate route to Camp Riversmeet. Until we investigate the camp itself, we cannot be certain. We must press on.
Follow him to the Black Iron Bridge. Which way? Where's that? Hold on, let's see. I can't see a damn thing on my choice. Follow him to the Black Iron Bridge. Oh, somebody knows where they're going. You know where you're going, don't you? Okay, uh, get off that. Hello, hello. There, pillion three. Where are we going? I don't even know where that is. You know where the Black Iron Bridge is, but I know not. Is that it? Is that as far as you go? Oh no. <laughs> Hello? That's another person joining us. Who's that? Where are we? What do we do? What am I looking for? you know I completely this is terrible isn't it I haven't got a clue what I'm doing search the camp for the missing knights okay well I think you'll find oh they're over here I sense a hostile presence Oh, hello, who's this? Who have we got here? This is Hopster. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Uh yes, hurrah. <laughs> right, let's talk to who's this. Who's this this party knight? Party knight. Aiding oh aiding. Oh hello. All disappeared. Are you alright? I heard sounds of a struggle. Thank thank the fury, I thought no one would come. Three heretics slain and one night saved. Just like that, you certainly live up to your reputation, Mistress Astaire. Well, he's a bit more polite than the other brother, isn't he? What happened here, sir? Is there no one else? We were caught in a furious blizzard north of here, my lord. <coughs> Not but white all around until we saw shapes moving towards us running towards us with naked steel in their hands I cut down a few of the bastards who came close but the others there was shouting and screaming but after a while I could only hear unfamiliar voices I found my way to the camp hoping to hide while the storm passed but the heretics tracked you here I <laughs> my lord the heretics hideaways lie Somewhere to the north, we must move quickly before the snow buries all traces of their passing. For my brothers, we must. Ha ha ha! That's just me putting it. I will drink some water though. We'll have a little hydration moment. I was only putting that on, it's just acting, darlings. You want a t shirt that says, You sense a hostile presence? <laughs> That'd be brilliant. I'd love that. <laughs> have faith sir justice will be done but first we must see you to safety uh, right uh, I'll have that they've got to be better than my other ones haven't they yes have I got room for them got you worried that's okay it said you see cough and weave in this little text they said you must cough and move and um, and have snowballs thrown at you. That's what it said. It's very important. Where are the gloves? There they are. Is there room in my armory chest? Good lord, there is. Yep. Yeah. Oh, what am I doing? Let's put those on. So, what do I need to put on this? What do I need to meld this with? 
Oh, my daughter's got a terrible cold. She doesn't live at home anymore. But she's got a terrible cold. Well, she doesn't live at home. She doesn't live at my home. She lives at her home. Um, and she's got a terrible cold, so yeah. Um, so I need to do the critical hit. Someone said critical hit. Yeah, let's get that on there. Because that's only 31. Oh no, that's on that one. What's that? It's only 20, isn't it? Should we get another critical hit on there? Will it let me? It will! Told you, Funky used to do the whole thing as a job for quite a few years. The whole voice acting malarkey. That was my thing. That's how I knew Stephen. Which is why we were here last week and essentially I suppose that's obviously you know how we've all become to be nice um, Final Fantasy 14 friends flu is a biatch as you said it says I, I oh, hold on I've got to allow that I permitted you to put that term in it said it's it's that I had to moderate that Hopsa, I didn't see that oh I've got a friend request that makes sense. Hey, accept. Oh, we'll see all these people that were uh, part of the vi vigil last week. They're all on their own different worlds or offline. Is that offline? No, that's offline and that's offline and they were last on a different world, I guess. I think that's it. Um, did I did I put the thing on? That's what it means. Oh, thank you. I'm oh Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you know I haven't even looked at the novice network chat. Um Shy recommended that I or invited me to it when we were on stream last week. I haven't even looked at the chat. I don't I don't use it. Because uh, I don't know anybody. <laughs> well, I do have friends now, obviously, in the game. Look at this. This is this is this is very fun. Just taking a screen, just taking a screenshot. Um, taking a screenshot. It said microphone audio is it being broadcast now, so I don't know if it cut out for a second. Look at you all, you crazy people. Let's talk to Arthur. We'll get there eventually. We'll never get to hear Stephen this evening. At the end of our hope. See, that would be terrible. <laughs> Off they go. Lord Arthur seems loath to forego any opportunity to locate the heretic's hiding place. Of course you're loath. I'm going to max out my gill with this one. He has the right of it, Mistress Astaire. Whatever remains of the heretic's trail will be gone with the next snowfall, but we cannot very well leave our friend here. I will see him to Falcon's Nest and gather reinforcements. In the meantime, I would have you search the area to the north of the camp for signs of the attack. Should you pick up the heretic's trail, do not wait for me. Follow it back to their lair forthwith, being sure to leave me some clear footprints. I realise that this plan... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just seen the beds. <laughs> it's hilarious. You lot hilarious. I love it. It's like <laughs> it's like really polite photo bombing in game. <laughs> oh dear, I'll get back to the what am I saying? That's where I'll I realise that this plan may place you in considerable danger, he says, laughing his head off. But I see no alternative. There is no alternative, Arturo. Rest assured, we will not be far behind. And Lana, thank you. You're welcome. He is so much more polite than the other brother, whose name is Emmanuel. No, oh, I can't remember. It used to break their backs. Okay, that sounds really dubious. On your friends list, if you would like to know who is online, you can... What can you do? You can check the Move Online players to the top checkbox. That way you don't have to scroll through everyone. I don't think they've got that many. I don't think they've got that many friends. Where are the friends? Fellowship Finder? No. Friendships. Fellowships. Friend list. Look, I know nothing. 
Move online players to the top of the list. There you are. Here's our party. I can't even start a party. I'm allowed to join them, but I can't start one. Is there five of us in the party now? That's weird. What are we doing? We're going... Um, where are we going? Where does it say we're going? Oh, I've clicked through too many times. Uh, we are going there. And I am... Oh, it's only that far. Oh, we got to go down. Okay. Ah, my carriage awaits. This is very fancy. Hello, oh, I'm in a different suit. Am I? No, I'm in the back. Yeah, look at us all go. It's the grooviest ride. I absolutely love it. Are there any other rides with like that you can have more people on? Mounts, I mean. No more people on. You're socking in the front seat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, we got to go in here. That's not right. Is, it, is that right? We've got to go in there? Are we all going in here? Is that what we do? Level sink. Oh, it's one of those level sinks. Hello, Mackay Bard. Hops at Owly Traveller. Eight. Eight. Battle time. I suppose I, I'm on my own now, aren't I? There'll be no party. You'll re-invite me later. Okay, thank you, Nemesis Rosa. The tracks continue to the north. Does it break up the party if you go and do one of these then, I guess? I know nothing. Find the heretic's hiding place. But where is it? Where? Where? Yeah, where, where the hell is it? Okay. Suspicious footprints. That looks like the right direction. Interacting. The tracks continue north. Yes. Are you going to try and get me, whoever you are? No. You do not care. Find the heretic's highlighting place. More suspicious footprints. Interact some more. Ah, so did I? So did I, did I just break up the party by doing that? Is that what happens? No. Okay. I just saw those suspicious footprints and interacted with them all right. You kicked me so I could get in. That's okay. I didn't even notice. <laughs> That's how much I know about the game. How? What other game can you play for this many hundreds of hours and not know what the hell's going on? Probably other one types of these on multiplayer online things. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's very sweet of you. I don't imagine it'll take me half an hour, will it? Oh, hello. These would say otherwise. I thought initially that it was like one of those um, you know, grab a party together or get some NPCs and go in a dungeon. And realise it was just a quest point, battle point.
I will read whatever it says there in a minute. And I'm being attacked. Oh, it says, get off. Hey, what did you say? You knew someone who played for thousands of hours only discovered recently that you could turn your character in the character creator? No? Oh, like, turn them, like, turn them around so you could see the back of them. <laughs> That's funny. Which way was I going? Does anybody know if I'm going the right way? Uh, oh, they came from behind this rock, didn't they? It's bound to be where the baddies are. Where the people are attacking you, that's the way to go, isn't it? It is the way. Oh, I'm having fun. I, I hope that whoever's here is having fun. There seems to be a few of you that joined in. It's just nice. This is lovely. Thank you ever so much. I think Shine was absolutely right. She's saying to me last week that you'll be affiliate or something soon, and I had to look into what she was talking about. And then uh, while I was away at uh, a family caravan trip last week I got an email saying he's done all these things you just need to stream another six days and then apparently I'll be affiliate it seems that's quite exciting I guess I seem to have mislaid all the footprints Am I going in? I have no idea where I am. It's not bad, is it, Funky? Where am I going? Am I going in the right direction? <laughs> I don't know where I am. Uh, yeah, apparently, because there were so many kind peeps that joined in with the... Uh, where the hell am I? With the stream last week, that I, my av the average viewers was something like 27. So after that, how do I know where I'm going? What about that boat? Is that anything to do with it? Can I go there? Is there something up here? I have no idea. Is this just a special little map for this quest or what? I feel like... Oh yeah, there were some footprints I found and then I started attacking people and got lost. No surprise there. I completely, I'm completely lost now. That's, there's a, that's a footprint. There's a footprint. Wait, did I miss a footprint back here? Maybe I just go this way. Well, that's a definitely a footprint. Going. Is that my footprint? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, thank you, Odvin, for following. I'm following my own footprints, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, well, that's not going to work, is it? <laughs> Classy. I do know how to play the game. I'm not distracted at all. Honest. What the hell am I doing? Anybody know where I am going? Being attacked, that's for sure. At the end of our hope, that's what everybody's thinking who's watching. There is no hope for Rob, he is, doesn't know what he's doing. Ah. 
I swear I came from this way. Will it not help me find my way back? I came from there. And we went this way. And let's just... We went up here. Uh, don't take your advice, you have to do it twice. <laughs> uh, I am I have tears of laughter on my face now, I'm crying at laughter at myself for being so crap. Maybe you've got to go up there. Who's up here? Let's just get you because you're bound to hit me. Oh, okay. Blowing everything at it. Get out of the way. No, you do not go up here. Okay. Well, okay. Down there? No, that doesn't look likely, does it? Oh god, what the hell's that? Oh! Got headphones on. That was that was slightly terrifying in my ears. A slush thing. That's great. I have not. I've got myself completely lost, haven't I? Yes. Welcome to the wastelands, everyone. <laughs> the icy wasteland of my mind. Oh, that's the edge. Oh, hello. Do we do that thing of just follow the bit and go left? Like you're in a maze. Where's the red line finish over here? So he does it. Okay, that's good. Okay. So we've ruled that bit out. Where was that boat? It's down here, isn't it? That's what I was thinking, Balthazar, but um, I, uh, I seem to have failed doing that I was following my own footsteps it's got to be up here isn't it why would they put those there oh, you know I'm busy oh what's that there that looks Oh man, okay, you know. A frost grenade? That seems to be a bit. Surely this has got to be it. Hello. Oh. What's in here? Oh, don't tell me, because I haven't followed everything. Try this game, it's what was I playing? Oh, it's playing Disney Dreamlight Valley. It says, you need to go and collect three mushrooms. You think, oh, I've got three mushrooms. It's like, I don't care, it says. You still have to go and collect three mushrooms. And you're running around trying to find all the resources. Oh, well look, it's obvious that I'm meant to come here, isn't it? But it says no. Computer says no. Oh, although well, there's another building over there. What is that one? Not so obvious. Who are you? You're not... Yeah, let's get rid of you.
Oh, I feel like I've been. At oh dear. I've made such a hash of this. Oh look, that's one of those pretty lights. Oh, there's another building over there. Crikey, it's massive. Okay. Dun da da da. Hello. Is there anyone at home? I do not think so. Oh, hello. Oh. Oh. Ha, ha, ha. Oh yeah. This seems to be where I was meant to be, but. I really don't want this to be here. So it's fighting all of a sudden, isn't it? Crikey! Well, I'm excited. I'll do all this and they'll go, no, you're not in the right place. You still lost the <laughs> You still failed the duty. Destination. Surveying. Yay! Gotta give myself a round of applause for finding my way when I was completely lost. <sighs> and the screen goes black. Yay! I know. Did it. Unbelievable. Who this? In their fancy garb. The quiet type. I do like that on my. Looking story. for me, I presume. Oh, it's you. I didn't know I was looking for you, but hello. Oh, it's you. Ah, the child who glimpsed the truth. No! It cannot be! She cameth unto me, as didst thou. Great voice, isn't it? Alike in gifts, yet set upon different paths. He speaks true, warrior of light. Like, like you, you, I have, I have been, been blessed, blessed with the echo. The visions, the visions terrified me at first. They, they came, came without, without warning. warning. I, wondered I wondered what, what I had done, done to deserve, deserve them. them. But I had I no had time, time to ponder, ponder such things, things once, once the calamity, calamity came. came. No. The land, the land turned, turned against, against us. us. And in and a matter, matter of hours, hours Falcon's nest, nest was buried under ten fulms of ice and snow. We, we had, had no, no choice, choice but to flee for Ishgard. Ishgard. Oh, that little piano in the background of the music is lovely. We came, we came to the, to the wall. wall. And, and while we searched, we searched for a way, way through, through, there was there an was avalanche. avalanche. 
and then I was alone. Oh, poor Iceheart. So I set forth for Dravania. I knew full well what might happen where I found. But I could not survive on my own. I was found, of course. And not by a mere dragon, but by the great worm Hreisvalga. Hreisvalga. And it was then that I knew why I had been given this gift. For with it I heard his voice and saw the truth through his eyes. I was chosen to deliver this revelation to the people. To bring dragon and man together as they once were and should ever be. Uh, yeah, the first one seems a really obvious thing to say. Killing the civilians won't bring them together. Well, it wasn't supposed, supposed to be like, like that. that. You have to wrong, believe me. It was, it was beyond my control. control. Was it now? Children, Children taught, taught to fear the skies. You saw, saw their loved ones slaughtered. slaughtered. Yet the, the Dravanians though they, they know, know where the, where the fault, fault truly lies, lies fell upon, upon them with, with such fury. Oh, how do I hide the mask? Can I do that in mid-thing? I probably can't, can I? Do you have to do that in the settings? You do, don't you? Oh, there's a settings. <laughs> oh. So you have to change that in the settings so you can see your face. It, oh. We'll have a look afterwards. Somebody tell me how to do it. I've gone through this. If you don't mind. That'd be great. Because um, it's nice to see some reactions other than just nodding. That would be lovely. Men die and their children forget. But we are everlasting. To us, then is as now. Isn't that voice great? Men die. I love it. Thou canst not comprehend the violation, the outrage, the fury. The fury. Love it. Brilliant. I will make this bright. I hope so. That'd be nice. I am neither a saint nor a saviour. Just another sinner. Yet I will not forsake this cause. I cannot. I will, I will see, see this, this cycle, cycle broken, broken and, and peace, peace restored. restored. Aren't the voice actors great for this? I'm sure they are in other languages too, but it's brilliant. I love it. It's really good. I. We, we can, can do, do naught else, else, for we, we are, are now, now as, as one. Bye, Midgard Sermon. Oh, it's so rare you get a bit of voice acting in it. It's such a lovely change when it comes. That's one of the brothers, isn't it? Yes, I recognise it. Mistress Sestaya, praise Haloni. Halone, Haloni? I don't know which one it is. I have to hear them first and then I'll forget anyway. Praise Haloni, you are alive. We came as swiftly as we could, but I see we are too late. Are we? What's happened? Oh, you didn't join in, he means. So they were lurking in the cellar of this farmhouse. Yes, they bloody were. It is a pity Lady Iceheart escaped, but we must not let that detract from your accomplishment. We have them on the run. You have dealt our foes a telling blow this eve, my friend, and I shall see that your efforts are recognised. Such a difference from the other brother. He's a right kid. Hello, everybody. Wow. You were all... Holy crap. What's this three-headed beast? What is that? 
What? With what? With what? How do I find out? Whose is that? Is that yours? How do I... I can't see what you've got. I don't know. That's... Yeah, <laughs> bunny rabbit. Oh my god, that's... Look at it! Right, okay, let's just get this tick done. At what else? Establishing an outpost in so remote a location could not have been easy. Tenacious devils. Tenacious devils indeed. Oof, nearly hit my limit on the gill. I would rather not linger. No, neither would I. The knights have matters here well in hand. Let us return to Falcon's Nest and share our discoveries with Sir Redwell. Come. After tracking heretics across mounds of ice and snow, I would dare say you are due a few hours rest next to a warm fire. Could do with a warm fire. Bye. Is that like. What, what outfit is that? Oh god, that's so good. All the outfits you've got. Amazing. Are we going on this beast? Where do we go? Oh, access teleport to Falcon's Nest. Uh. Yes. What? How? Who did that? When you open your character menu, the hat icon. Hold on. Let's do that. Let's do this thing that Gravity Bunflex is suggesting. Uh, when you open your character menu, below. Oh, hold on. Below here. Uh, hide display headgear. Is that the one you mean? Ah. So, uh, then, oh, hello, face. Okay, so, oh, I see, yes, yes, somebody's hat's coming on and off there. That's you, great, okay, cool. Are we in the right place now? Did somebody just teleport me to the right location? That seems very generous and kind of you. I seem to have done that. Ah, da, 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 da. So, where am I going over here? Hello, Redwald. Oh, hello. Somebody's got some great slippers. Fantastic. Talk to Redwald. I can't remember what voice I did for Redwald. Never mind. Slightly lower, I think. Lord Atwarel, Mistress of Steyr, full glad am I to see you both hale and healthy. What news? You mean to say you hunted the heretics down on your own and slew them before reinforcements could arrive? By the fury! I believe we have made great strides towards purging these lands of heretics, and I mean to say as much when I deliver my report to my father at the Holy See. Hold on. Is it tempting me to think that I'm going to get to hear Stephen now? Because that would be stunning. As will I, Lord Atwarel. May it serve to remind our superiors what houses Durandere and Forton could achieve through continued cooperation. Indeed, I trust you and your knights are content to handle the rest? We most certainly are, my lord. During your short time with us, you and Mistress Estire have accomplished far more than I had thought possible. I cannot in good conscience impose upon you any longer. Pray return to Ishgard with my thanks. As you wish, Sir Edward. We thank you for your hospitality. And you bow, and I stand there. Do I not even nod? No, not even a nod. Back to Ishgard. Well, this is exciting. Uh, Fort on Manor? No, no, this is too much. This is too exciting. Are we going? Are you coming to join me? What, uh, ooh, somebody just went funny there. Oh, I can't do that. Somebody else has to save me, is that right? Oh dear. Wake up! Wake up! So, am I, am I not allowed to teleport because I am not the party leader? So, would somebody like to teleport us back? Maybe they're not listening. 
I can't teleport to the little ones. No. I've got to go to the big city ones. Was I doing the wrong one? I was doing the wrong one. Oh! I said no. I meant to say yes. Yes. To foundation. I think... Maybe... Uh, maybe Drazan, you can only... Oh, anybody can teleport to him. Oh. I am learning, Nimsistrosa. I am learning. Of course, I don't know which way I'm going. Um, so, I'm just going to go... It's this way. Is it this way? It says... Oh, no, I keep doing that. Because I... Because I'm... Yeah, I'm not going to talk to them yet. I'm going to do phrase... Um, maybe I'll start that another day. Which way do, which way do we go? Don't run. Am I running? Which way? Uh, I don't know my way around. I'm just going to go to the one um, shard I know about. You can use the big ether to go to the little ones? Can you? <laughs> that is... Uh, no, I can't. Oh, we can. Ethernet. Oh my good lord. Look at that. 250 hours and I've only just found that out. For hunky, you <laughs> are showing me up beautifully. That's fine. I don't mind. I don't mind being silly and wrong. I never knew that. I always thought I had to run off to one of the other ones. <laughs> I think some people. This is this is you, isn't it? You're paying your respects while I go indoors. Well, this is adorable. Adorable, yeah. Yeah. Maybe a little cry for that. It's made me emotion. The Liturgy of the Bell. 18,000 things that I... Oh, gosh. You prayed for that long before you found out, too. I think it must be about... Two, it was, well, it was 250 hours last Monday, so... Welcome, Mr. Sire. Shall I show you inside the manor? Yes, please. If Stephen... If we get a voice acting bit and Stephen here, I'm, I'm going to get emotional. Atwarel, what are you going to say to me now? Mistress Sestire, I would speak plain. From the first, I questioned your motives and your competence. Unjustly, I now realise. Rumours have a way of growing more fantastic as they spread, and quite frankly, those surrounding you beggar belief. But Rochefort swore that all the stories were true. He championed your cause and begged Father to grant you patronage. I know, it was nice. And he duly listened, because for all his wisdom he has never been able to say no to my dear half-brother, the legacy of my father's soul in discretion. Mother hated him, of course. Even on her deathbed she refused to acknowledge him. And, to be honest, she was not alone in her feelings. But that is not the worst of it. At Camp Riversmead, when we came upon the wounded knight, I knew immediately that one of us would have to pursue the heretics alone. An onerous task, fraught with danger. And there you were, the saviour of Eorzea, an honoured guest of House Forton, my new comrade in arms, Horshfold's dear friend. I told myself it was to be a test, but part of me, part of me hoped that you would fail. Yet you accepted the task without a word of protest, nor any sign of fear, and you duly tracked the enemy down. <laughs> well, yes, I duly tracked him down. I didn't stumble across them. I faced him alone and lived to tell the tale. Plainly, Horshfon had the right of it all along, and that I doubted your strength bespeaks mine own weakness, but I will not doubt you again, Mr. Sire. On that, you have my word. Well, thank you very much. <clears throat> Sip of water there. Oh, what have we got here? Oh, I need, I need one of those for something else. Two slots remaining in my inventory. Okay. What 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 to say now? Huh. Wait, 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 what? Oh the steward. Oh come on. Looks as though he has something to say. 
he may not may or may not have tried to get me killed cheerio <laughs> That is what he just said, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see what the divine intervention is now. Oh, look, I recognise those faces in the little box. Ah, oh, Mistress Astaire, my lord, the Count much desires to speak with you regarding your time. Oh, please, this is going to be great. Oh, I am getting emotional with you. Regarding your time with Lord Atuera and Lord Emanelaine, if you would remain here for a moment. Okay, who's ready? Who's ready for more critch? I'm going to shut up now while he speaks. The hero returns. I cannot thank you enough for saving young Emanelaine's life. Aye, aye, he told me everything. Huh. Ah, oh dear. It's very weird. Because <laughs> obviously I was... <clears throat> I'm not a part of this game at all. I'm just part of our community now. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, let's listen to some more. I've also received letters from both House Samile and Durandir praising your conduct and that of House Fortom. You have won as much honour, my friend. Whew. <clears throat> you've won as much as you've won. You've got lots of honor my old friend my lord what is it speak pray forgive the intrusion my lord but I, I bring grave tidings master Alfano and mistress Tataro have been detained on suspicion of fermenting heresy oh god no what explain they, uh, they were observed entering a tavern in the lower levels on some half dozen occasions. There, it is claimed, they made a number of inquiries. Inquiries which brought them into contact with certain um, elements. It was this which prompted a Knight of the Heavens War to demand that they be questioned. Sir Grino, my lord. Sir Grino is a brute. An exceedingly accomplished brute, but a brute nonetheless. Alas, he is also a son of House Zamayo. How quickly we forget the petty nature of men. I'd wager your friends are no more than pawns in another of my countrymen's games. Such is the way of things between the high houses. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, well that was bloody great. How long did it take me? From sure, it's been weeks since I did that post to say that I was came across Stephen's voice and I was really emotional. And then all of you lot prompted me to um, prompted me to stream last week, and we had our vigil, and now here we are. And look what are we? I mean, this is like nearly two hours of being on the game. I know I've been messing around and getting lost in the snow haven't we and having nice rides in a four seat car <laughs> ah. oh, that was a, that was amazing to hear his voice then thank you for sharing that with me and for being here and letting me share it with you my experience of it <sighs> oh Balthazar I'm so glad that you made it too it's absolutely a great joy to have everybody here uh, there is there is all your dad yeah <laughs> I don't know I, can, I don't think of him as my dad I went on his stag do I can't think of him as my dad um, but <laughs> yeah I know he's all your dad he's yeah that's wonderful what is um See now, what what do I do? I can't do Stephen's voice now. This that would be 
that would be yeah no can't imitate Stephen I you can be our <laughs> I can be your FF14 uncle <laughs> I do me yes I know I know I know but um just I, I think of it I can hear his voice in my head doing it I'm sure you all can that thing when you've heard a voice so many times but um <laughs> yeah well let's just read it um so count Edmond my honor to Stephen my little tribute to him and do do some voice acting alongside him Though you have won the hearts and minds of many of my countrymen, there are those who will never be swayed, men who will dismiss your efforts and resent your successes, even as we celebrate them. It is like that one such member of House Zemile is manipulating Sir Greno, for he is not a man to dabble in politics of his own volition. He may genuinely believe your friends to be guilty though I am quite certain his masters know better. Yet the truth will avail us naught if we cannot prove their innocence. You would do well to speak with Sir Ermeric at the congregation of our knights most heavenly. He will know more of these charges. Thank you. Thank you, Stephen, slash Edmund, slash everybody. Well, there we go. That's it now. Don't have to do any more ever again. <laughs> I've heard his voice. No, I, oh, this is amazing. Um, okay, what do we do? Do we get out of here? Ah, oh, thank you. Oh, let's hold on a minute. Let me just... Thank you, dear friend. I'm going to do all of it. Don't worry, Drazan. I'm going to play the whole darn game. I'm I'm here for the long haul. Ten thousand hours will seem like nothing by the time I finish with it. He says. If I live that long. Um Right. Hello everybody. We all just yeah oh playing dead again. In your big in your long boots. Everyone's got such amazing outfits. Raise oh and they disappear. Bye oh. and back they come. Right, where do we go next? In stay with Amelic in Foundation. Where is Amelic in Foundation? Uh there. Where am I? Is there? Can we go there? It's probably round the corner, isn't it? I've just teleported like further away. I've done that before. It's like when I lived in London. Get the tube. Get the tube somewhere you didn't need to be. Hold on. So that's Frey. Where is there? Ah, there. Divine intervention. Uh, you need to spend your gill on something. Oh yeah. Okay. Should we go to the um? Let's go to the jewellery quarter. I don't think it's called that, but... Diddle -diddle -diddle -diddle. The jewelled crozier. Let's go down the street and spend it on something. What should I spend it on? Teleporting is something, yeah, I know. See, I don't Who cares? Just money. What? See, oh, there's no point in buying things for this character, is it? Um let's see. Who should we buy things for? Uh da -da -da. Oh I've got light level. So we get a ring. Let's get a couple of rings. We could buy a couple of rings for the crafting. Can is there a craft ring? That's a craft ring. Oh. Oh no. I can't. <laughs> That's as high as it goes. Okay, can't buy any current rings. Do, 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 do. What shall I do? What shall I do? Um, what else have we got? Sundries. 
armor. A patrician's wedge cap. I don't know. Well, that's going to do nothing for me. What about that one? Oh, that might. What about that? So, oh gosh, 54. What about that? That's good, isn't it? That'll help with the crafters. Let's buy that. You're on your way to visit. <laughs> what, in the game? I'm assuming you mean in the game. I've been here for two hours and look, I've just finally met Stephen and his voice, Stephen. Edmont and heard Stephen's voice again. Isn't that great? So lucky. Uh, more craft craftsmanship. 142? That's got to be better than whatever I've got on. Yeah, baby! That's fantastic. Let's get that. And, uh... I can't fit any more in. <laughs> Uh, but I can't, can I even fit them? Fit them in my armory chest? I do not know. So that has got to go in. Please fit. Oh, it did. Oh, that did not. <laughs> Imagine having too much money. Yeah, well, it isn't yeah, too much money. It's paltry amount of money, isn't it, compared to compared to you know what people. I saw somebody. Oh, I was telling this earlier. I saw somebody uh, posted a thing that said on Reddit earlier today they did their first ever raid, and someone commended the player and just gave him a, thousand, a million gil. Well, there you go. Well done. <laughs> How sweet is that? That's very kind. Linen smock. A linen smock. Yeah, it's really lovely. I tell you, this community, this game is fantastic. I cannot desynthesize that. What am I doing with these things? I suppose I should just be discarding them. Can I discard it? I can. Go away. I don't want it. Uh, that's good. What about that? Linen smock. See, so retrieve that. It'll go with the others. Oh, do I see? Will it let me desynthesize that? Will it make any difference? No, I have no space. But I now can put this thing in, can I? Uh, place that in the armory chest. That's good. Um, which ones have we got? So we've got the turban of crafting and the doublet of crafting. Am I going to have room for these material or not? I have no more space. No! Outrageous. Okay, uh, what do I put in? Let's put some things in here because um, I need to sort this out. I will put it another time, but this is stupid, isn't it? Look at these things. What have I got on these? I've got all these copies of some orchestration rolls. Well, I get, I get all those again, will I? I've got two of them. Why do I need them? Who knows? Who knows? I probably should do these treasure maps as well, shouldn't I? I'm such a fool. Let's get these out. You know, sometimes it is quite easy to realize, to think to yourself that you're just talking to yourself and think it's all just a random computerized thing. And that's not a, a, a slight on anybody that's, that's here. Talk with me. It's lovely. Um, <coughs> I don't really need those faded copies. Okay. I don't know what they're for. It's that, it's that thing of the game being so vast and you think, goodness me, what will I do 
if I lose that thing and then suddenly I have to spend five hours doing hundreds of runs through the through a dungeon to get them again. I'll get rid of them now. Oh, well that's pretty good. That's that will up those and then obviously I can Oh, she looks better too. Yeah, I've got to craft them. That's what I thought. Right. Um, what have we got? We have got craftsmanship. Let's add a bit more craftsmanship. Uh, oh, a bit more craftsmanship. Go on then. And then we'll have a level one thing just to. Fingers crossed. Oh, it did not work. There we go. And then we will... Uh, let's put some... Uh, do I want to put control on? Yeah, I do. I think someone's going to say, No, you do not. If I get rid of that one... And that's another one. That's an extra space in the inventory. Ha! -ha. There we go. That's not bad going, is it? Carpenter registered. It's just. Uh, oh, I'm not going to go through all the crafted ones and do that again. We'll get back to that after. So that's that's not bad. Let's spend a bit of money and got rid of some space in there although I can discard these you say so let's discard them I take your word for it because you know what else am I doing with them I've got hundreds of hours to play this game thousands blank grade one orchestration roll why have I got that see I just kept too much stuff I don't really I haven't looked at it have I I've just gone through You'd think, with all the hours I've played the game, well, I might have spent some hours just randomly looking at this stuff. Like, what's that? Why do I need a dart from? Who knows? Um, okay, where are we going? We have got... Amalian. Amalian is you. Where is you? Are we there? Are you just right by me? Hello? Hello? Well, welcome. How, how absolutely brilliant. How do I say hello? Oh, I don't know. Where's the things? I don't know what they all are. I am happy. A friend request. Hey, yes. With pleasure. Look at all these people that I do and don't know. Oh, what's that little symbol that says that? Oh, you're not in the party. I see. Hello, hello, hello. Isn't that great? Um, hi folks, we're all here. Oh, somebody's very faint there. He needs if he disappeared. Well, you've joined our party. How many people can you have in the party? Where do we go now? We've got to go to Aimrick. Is it easier to go with this? We are going to go up here. That one, that one, that one, that one. Thank you, Nemesis Rosa. That's lovely. Uh, oh, have I got it up in there? In here? In here? We go in here. Ooh. Oh, Aimric. The voice actor, the English voice actor for this. It's got great voice too. Oh, we don't get to him there got such a great voice. can't remember what it's like. Let's do something probably too similar to the one I did for Admiral. It has been too long, Lana. Would that this visit came under happier circumstances. You are come to plead for Master Alfino and Mistress Tataru, I take it. Tataru? Tataru? I think it's that way, isn't it? Tataru? I am. She nods. 
Word of their detainment reached us while I was delivering my report on the Vanu Primal. Truly I know not which is the more ludicrous, these charges or that flying feathered whale. <laughs> it was amusing. That was last week we saw that. That Sir Grinnell's Grino's accusations are baseless, I have no doubt. Refuting them will be difficult, however, as he is a knight of the Heaven's Ward. I speak of the personal guard of the Archbishop, the twelve finest knights in all of Ishgard, sworn to serve his eminence alone. Suffice it to say, their testimony is unimpeachable, and I have not the authority to challenge their actions. After all the scions have done, routing the heretics and defeating Shiva, helping us to defend the steps of faith and drive back the Trevanian horde, after proving themselves true allies on countless occasions, is there naught we can do? That's right, Hoshfam, is there naught? I fear there is but one path left to us. We must demand a trial by combat. That sounds fun. All oh, the music says it is. But of course... In a trial by combat sanctioned by the Inquisition, the victor's claim is judged true regardless of the petitioner's standing. What? Under Ishgardian law, a trial by combat pits the accuser against the accused. In this instance, Master Alfino and Mistress Tatar Tataru would be expected to face Segrino and a second of his choosing, another knight of the Heaven's Ward, most like. Two of them? By the fury, that can hardly be considered fair. Master Alfino's magical talents will not have gone unnoticed, meaning that he will have no choice but to participate. Mistress Tataru, on the other hand, is quite obviously bereft of martial skill and should be afforded the right to name a champion to fight in her stead. Well, I can see where this is going. Lest you doubt, I am ready and willing to serve in this capacity, as I am sure is Lord Hochfond, but Hochfond, but all here present know that you are the most accomplished warrior among us, and may happen the realm at large. Well, that's very flattering, isn't it? I nod in agreement. Then it is settled. I will visit Malster Alfino at once and inform him of our intentions. Lana, meet me at the tribunal when you have made ready. Until then, my friend. Ooh. Crikey, it's cold in my house. Bear with me for a couple of minutes. I'm just going to go, what do they call it? Comfort break time. Uh, back in three minutes, maybe? Three minutes? Hopefully. Three minutes. Give me a, couple, a second.
back. I don't know if that was three minutes. No idea. But I'm back. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, a bit longer than I expected. I said hello to my wife upstairs and my daughter. Hello, welcome back. I am back. My daughter, who's 21, is at home texting and saying, She's too poorly, she's too poorly, and we're trying to tell her not to go to work tomorrow and she's worried about losing a job if she doesn't go in, you know how it is, everyone knows how it is. <sighs> you can't keep going into work though, can you, being ill? It doesn't help. Right. Where were we? What were we doing? Oh, I love this. I do love this bow, it has to be said. It's not a good situation, is it? No, it's not good. But uh, hopefully, my wife Jules will um, be able to persuade her not to do that. Where am I going? This is the way out. Is this the way out? This is the way out. Oh, hello. Look at everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. This is all these sparkles. And fantastic. Where do we go? Where am I going? I'm going down to the pillars. Oh, don't go to Frey again. Stop it. I'm so stupid. Guy, let's go. Um, which way am I going? <laughs> oh dear. I know not where I am going. I'm so lost in this place. I'll get there. Uh, oh, okay. No, that's not where I want to go, is it? Oh. Well, I guess it's out. Let's just go down here and out, is it? Is this, is this the way out? Looks like it's the way out. If I left you all behind, sorry. This is the gatekeeper. I've not been out here before. Hello, are you going to let me out? Can I just go? I can. I come here as if I am in some some weird place. That I, oh, it's there! Divine intervention is there, which is next to the tribunal. Okay. I'm so stupid. I'm distracted by my daughter situation, I think. at the footsteps of my lovely friends behind me. People, who knows? <laughs> I feel like there's a game that you play at school where <laughs> is somebody following me? Are they there? Uh, is that here? No? Probably. Must be up there. What else would it be? In here, surely. Oh, yes. Wash fall. Oh. Oh, it's one of these. Oh, it looks like one of those battles. Listen carefully, Lana. When the trial begins, the petitioner will be asked to restate his charges and the accused invited to respond. Then, in accordance with the law, they will be asked to restate their request for a trial by combat. Once the High Adjudicator acknowledges Mistress Tataru's right to name a champion, that is when you must make your entrance. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on Sir Grillo's face when he sees his true opponent. Twill, opponent, twill be priceless. More seriously, should you begin to lose heart, look to me in the stands and I shall cheer so loud you will wonder how you could ever have contrived to doubt yourself. Now, are you ready? No.
We are gathered here today under the watchful gaze of the Fury to ascertain the guilt of two souls in a trial by combat. Petitioners, step forward. Sir Grino, for the benefit of all here present, I would ask you to repeat the charges which you have leveled against this man and this woman. Yes, let's hear I, Sir Grino de Zemile, brother of the Heaven's Ward, did bear witness to these two foreigners consorting with heretics. Oh dear. Let the accused step forward. Alfino Levia, Tataru Taru, you have heard the charges leveled against you. Will you take up arms to refute Sir Grino's claim and thereby prove your innocence in the eyes of gods and men? I, Alfino Levia, am innocent of this charge and claim my right to trial by combat. I, Tataru Taru, am innocent of this charge. But. I am no warrior and cannot fight. So, I claim the right to name a champion. That's right. Oh, To the old and the infirm, the young and the weak, this right we allow. Very well. Who will stand for this woman? Door opens. Just as I was beginning to doubt the efficacy of the Ishgardian justice system. Come, my friend. Let us put an end to this mama's farce. Let's. Lots of nodding. Oh. Oh. Oh, we fight in there, do we? Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, oh. oh Haloni, render unto us your judgment. Raise up the righteous and cast down the wicked. Here we go. But they do look a bit fierce. What's going on here? Down with you! I was not expecting that. I'm 
doesn't look good. Done. It wasn't funny. <laughs> That's right, you bow in shame. Gosh, have we really been doing this for two and a half hours? Wow. They, they, I mean, we won! Yes, Tataru, we won! <coughs> the Fury has spoken. Alfino Levelier, Tataru Toru. You are hereby acquitted of all charges. Thank you, Balthazar. Blessed are we who receive of her wisdom and see justice wrought by her divine hand. Petitioners accused, go forth in peace. Delivered from an untimely demise yet again, my thanks as always. The obligatory nodding. Ah, your level is no longer synced. By the fury, what a splendid victory! To see how you strove in the face of adversity, two brave young souls bound together by the puissant bonds of camaraderie. Why, it stirred me to the very depths of my soul. Having been treated as such a rousing spectacle, it seems only right that I present you with a humble token of mine admiration. Pray receive of me this chocobo whistle. Another one. Another whistle. With it you may summon a black chocobo, fully trained and ready to fly. That sounds fancy. Not as fancy as all the ones everybody else has been showing me the mounts of the mounts they've got this evening, but it's still fancy for me. Magnificent is she not? Strong yet sleek, elegant yet eager. What say you, Lana? Will you take her for your steed? I damn well will. Thank you very much. Lord Oshvon, chocobos are prohibited in the supreme sacred tribunal of Halonic Inquisitory Doctrine. Your steed must remain outside. Oops. He should have known that, eh? Oh, don't silly me, he says. Don't. Have I got space for it? Silly me. Oh, how did I ever forget? Ether Currents. Oh, somebody mentioned this last week. Collection expanded. Ether Compass acquired. I've what? You've obtained a black chocobo. When riding this mount, you will have the ability to fly, provided certain con oh. certain conditions have been met. All right, what have I got to do? To fly in a given region, you must first find and attune to all the local ether currents. In order to attune to some ether currents, you will need to complete certain quests. What a damn surprise. However, most can be discovered via exploration. To aid you in this endeavor, you have also obtained an ether compass, which will provide you with both the bearing and the distance to the nearest ether current upon use. The ether compass can be found under collection in the duty section of the main menu. To review your progress, select Travel from the main menu, followed by Ether Currents. Ah. 
I have an item of interest to your collection. Other such keepsakes found on your adventures will be stored here, viewable at any time, should you wish to reflect on your past deeds. There you go, see? I have now only got collection. Shadowbringers. Shadowbringers. I know not. Okay, uh, sort. What? Oh. Okay, so we now have... What's that? Oh, another orchestration room. Oh, I've already got that one. It's quality of life stuff, not spoilers. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I think you're all very kindly not doing spoilers for me, and I, I very much appreciate it. Uh... Let's add that one to my favourites. Notice that one is not in my favourites. It's so slow and annoying. Um, and what do I do? Oh, well, I've got to be outside anyway to do that, surely. So let's just talk to Oshwan. And <coughs> well, I think I should get some water. Oh, I've got some water. Hydration break, everyone. Not break. Don't forget. Got to stretch. Oh, bloody hell. Stand up. Oh, that's better. A bit of water. Stretch of the legs. <coughs> uh, is that is that like a hydration emoji? The emoticon emoji? I don't know what to do. Oh. <laughs> little pat on the head. Don't worry, Rob. We're not going to spoil things for you. <laughs> Lord Oshwan thinks you could do with a well-deserved rest. Of course I could. Black chocobos are well and good, are all well and good, but the true reward for your efforts is the exoneration of your comrades. Head pat emotes, very cute, I like it. They shall be released upon the completion of certain minor formalities. Oh, they're not released yet. Which I mean to see to personally. In the meantime, pray return to Forton Manor. The Count has done so already and will doubtless be eager to discuss the day's events. Come on. Bye, let's go talk to Stephen. Where be? Where be? Come on. It's just up there, isn't it? I don't need to do any stupid jumping around. It's over here, isn't it? Isn't it? Have I in the right place? It's not, is it? No, it's not there. I don't know where I am. Okay. Let's just use this. For I know not where I am. Oh, it's just over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Thank you all so much for joining me. I'll just say again, it's just a... It's a real joy to be here playing this game with you all by my side. It's, um... It's lovely. <laughs> I appreciate it very much. Let's go inside the manor. You miss... Hello, Swiftfear! Welcome! You missed me schooling those bullies, those Heaven's Ward bullies. I did, yeah. Beat them at their own game. <laughs> said Swiftfear. <laughs> That's what Swiftfear said. It wasn't me. Oh, is he going to speak or do I have to just read? Please speak. Oh, no. Okay. Lonely smiles on us yet again, Mistress Asaya, guiding you to victory and setting your comrades free. I swear that's not the voice I did for Ammonia. Atwaral. I confess I did fear for your safety, sure you did, which is not to say I doubted your prowess, you understand. I merely knew the strength of your opponents. <coughs> yes, indeed. You do have a habit of exceeding my expectations. I thought he was nice. Oh, here's the one. Your man lane. Besting two of the Heaven's Ward while the city's elite looked on by the fury. Anyone who has been paying attention to you will surely do so from now on. Oh, Hops has finally managed to get something to eat. This is a good idea. Yeah, I'll be having another stack after my stream. I started a diet today. I've got a lot of weight to lose. I'm of the age where it's necessary. Oh, knock on the door. Come on in. My, my lord! 
We have just received a message from the vault. His Eminence, the Archbishop, requests the presence of Mistress Astire. An invitation from the Archbishop? I'm forgetting how I'm doing. I used to do... <laughs> uh, I did a few audiobooks when I was doing the voiceovers for and keeping track of all the voices. It's hard. The best thing I did was read stories to my daughter, of course, when she grew up and she'd go, No, that's not so-and-so's voice. I'd forget what I was doing. What an honour, says Artoiro. A personal summons is indeed a great honour, and given recent events, you would be wise not to delay. Go, Mr. Sestire, we shall speak anon. Oh, so comforting, even if it's not Stephen's voice, just having his character is lovely. A priest will be waiting for you outside the vault. Identify yourself to him and he will escort you inside. And lock me up, probably. <coughs> Bye, Count. Off I go. Did you have something tasty, Hopsa? Are you feeling replete? Full and happy to be have eaten. Where have we got to go? I've got to go over there. Is it a straight line? Let's not do the things. Let's try and figure out where I am. The architect, hello. Ah. Oh, got to go all the way up those steps. The hoplon. Disclosure. Speak with the priest at the vault. Hello, Ashgard, Ishgardian, Ashgard, Ishgardian priest. We are honoured to receive you, Mr. Sestire. This way, please. It is my honour to present to you the Warrior of Light. What a great voice. It's so light and rich at the same time. I have heard the tales of your many grand endeavours. The Lord Commander has also been most effusive in his praise. <laughs> well... If you say so, Funky. I am Thorin the Seventh, Archbishop of the Ishgardian Orthodox Church, and I bade you come here that I might offer my personal apologies. You will forgive me for not calling upon you as courtesy would dictate, but as you can see, my more sprightly days are long behind me. But I digress. You do digress. Your companions were wrongly accused of heresy and subjected to gross indignities. This, I am sorry to say, was the result of negligence on the part of our nation's protectors. Negligence born of an excess of zeal. Is that not so, Sir Zephyrin? Yes, Your Eminence. Regrettably, it would appear that we of the Heaven's Ward were in receipt of erroneous information. Everyone just calls in the Pope. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's go. I will join in. I will join that happy throng of people. We say everyone. That's like millions of people. You know, like 25 million people play this game? That's nuts. Sebrino has ever been headstrong. He pressed charges before the truth had been ascertained. For which I most sincerely apologize. An unfortunate misunderstanding born of an earnest desire to serve Ishgard, but one which should never have occurred. For who could doubt the character of those who bested Shiva and drove the Horde from the steps of faith? Not I, that much is certain. 
That will be all, Sir Zephyrin. I would speak with our guest in private. In private. Your Eminence? I... I... As you wish, Your Eminence. That will be all for today. Getting some funny looks, aren't I? Privacy is a luxury rarely afforded one in my position. So when you say cosplaying, like does that mean like in the game dressed as that character? Or cosplaying in real life? Um not that it matters. I shouldn't have asked two questions at the same time for a yes or no answer, should I? So, cosplaying in the game. <laughs> I set myself up for failure in getting the response I needed there, didn't I? <laughs> ah, that's quite fancy, isn't it? To be able to get that far in the game, I suppose, and then you can dress in all the fancy gears. Like everyone who was in the party. They're just... Amazing outfits people have got. I am just whatever is the best thing at the time at the moment. Privacy is a luxury rarely afforded. Oh, and what am I doing? He's 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 a voiceover. Carry on. Now tell me, young lady, what do you know of the Asians? Precious little. Much and more, I should wonder. Being the bringer of light. You should know that I myself have met with them, have entertained them as guests, even. Oh, it's nice to get a voice in Those there. harbingers of chaos and strife offered us power that we might continue our war against the dragons. I have no intention of aiding their cause, of course, nor less of being their puppet. Yet, were I to refuse them outright, I should learn naught of their true objectives and remain powerless to stop them. Thus have I hearkened to their words with interest and paid lip service to their beliefs, biding my time and preparing for the inevitable conflict. And why do I tell you this? Because there is naught in this world they fear more than the power of the warrior of light. And so they should. Sorry. If we are to rid ourselves of these vile interlopers, we must needs work together. With our combined strength, I have faith that we can wrest Eorzea from their grasp and pave the way for a lasting peace. Think on it. Oh, I will. What a rich, juicy voice that man has. I have spoken with the priest of the vaults. What do I do now? Speak with Alphana. That Photon Manor. The plot, as you say, Balthazar, thickens. It does thicken. Like a good sauce. Oh, dear me. Back I go. Yes, inside the manor, let me in. I love that you all know what's going on. I have no clue. There you are. I confess, I was more than a little concerned when I learned that you had been summoned to the vault. What did they want with you? Well, well. A formal apology and an admonishment of those responsible. I see my fears were wholly misplaced. That's really sweet of you, Nemesis Rosa. You, 
What game? What other game are you playing? <clears throat> There's many more games, isn't there? I know. During streams like this, I suppose you could be forgiven for thinking that Final Fantasy XIV is the only game there is when there's millions of others. Fantasy Star Online 2. Oh, I played a little bit of that. Yeah. It came to the Xbox for free for a while, I think. I don't even know if it still is. Is it good? Is that another... Is that another big? That's another big multiplayer, like online multiplayer thing, isn't it? Am I remembering the right thing? It came out PS4 last month too, did it? Did it now? I do have both of them, the Xbox and the PlayStation. But I quite like that I can see the chat on the screen while I'm streaming here on the PlayStation. I don't think I can do that on the Xbox on my TV screen, you know. Obviously, because I've not got all the fancy, you know, uh, set up for streaming other than just going straight out. No, I had a look. At, I had a look um, uh, uh, yesterday. I think on the Xbox because I think I'm going. Well, I am going to give a try at uh, streaming some Disney Dreamlight Valley tomorrow afternoon. So. Um, yeah, I thought I'd make sure it was working. I haven't tested out the Xbox setup yet, so wait for my hour of completely muted microphones again. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that. Yeah, so uh, I'm going to do another... What are we? Um, we're just after... Just coming up to 10 to 10 UK time. 10 p.m. UK time. 10 to 10 p.m. UK time right now. So I'm going to do another hour and 10 minutes. Finish about 11 p.m. Uh, and then um, I will be doing I'll say all this again and again I don't know why I've started saying it now just having a break from the story for a minute I suppose since Nemesis Rosa was talking about other games uh, I'm going to do more of this Final Fantasy 14 on Thursday this week did I say Thursday? I think I said Thursday I should check before I give you bad information that I made it yeah, I'm going to do the same thing. 7 p.m. UK time Thursday. I'm going to try and do that. I thought I'd try just to do like two evenings and two afternoons in a week. So, yeah, so tomorrow afternoon I'm going to do 2 p.m. UK time for a few hours and try Disney's Dreamlight Valley, see how that goes. And then Sunday, 2 p.m. to 6 p.m., I'm going to do um, a, uh, you know, I don't know, something variety stream <coughs> so yeah gonna try that for a few weeks see how it goes um, yeah it's gonna be it'll be interesting won't it something to do keeps me off the streets like stops me standing outside the chip shop um, where were we they were saying some things I'm By the gods. Oh god. The Archbishop freely admits to consorting with Asians. He did. So their ambitions extend to Ishgard as well. They do. I know Alphano. I'll get used to your new voice. We will have new primals to contend with ere long, of that you may be certain. Tis but a matter of time. Yet shorn of the support of our missing allies, what can we realistically hope to achieve? I don't know. In the midst of all the excitement, <laughs> I completely forgot to tell you. That made me jump. That's funny. <laughs> Sataru, what are you doing? What have you got to tell me? Go on. When I was asking around about the Scions, I heard the most awful rumour. General Rauburn is to be executed for crimes against the Sultanate. You what? Do what? If the Flame General dies... We will lose a staunch ally, and the one man capable of holding the Sultana's assassins to account. Lord Orshifon was wise to counsel restraint, but this business will brook no delay. It will brook no delay, Alphino. <laughs> well, if, if either of you were driving, Nemesis Rosa, when you, when you jumped, I, I don't think that's good. <laughs> we cannot permit this execution to take place. We must save Raoban. We must save Raoban. We must. I wonder if we can do it in the next hour. 
complete. Quest complete. Lucky number seven achievement unlocked. Alfino, can we do this in the next hour? Share, share your plan. Though the situation calls for urgency, it would avail us little to charge headlong into Uldar without a plan. Before we can formulate a plan, however, we must first learn how things stand in the Sultanate, which is why I propose that we visit Limsa Liminsa. Aye, you heard me right. While you were about your altruistic endeavours, I acted as an intermediary in trade negotiations between House for Tom and a Liminsian court. I sorry, and the Lemincen Consortium. During said negotiations, an opportunity to send word to the Admiral presented itself, and I duly seized it. I am happy to report that we ha yet have a stout ally in Limsa. The Admiral has pledged her full cooperation in any effort to rescue Rauban. Good. Accordingly, I have agreed to meet with her, that we might discuss how best to proceed. Naturally, I told her to expect us both. Your presence never fails to embolden our allies, after all. Well, of course. When you arrive in Limsa Liminsa, make yourself known to Sergeant Xanthael at Bullock Hall on the lower decks. He will admit you to the bridge. Okie doke. Let's go. Off to Limsa we go. Change of scene. Just going to grab some water. Excuse me. Don't know if the sound will go as I walk into my kitchen. <clears throat> Got to hydrate, folks. It gives me an opportunity to stretch my legs, too. Which isn't a bad thing. I still haven't got a very good seat. I'm sitting on the edge of my sofa. <laughs> oh, look. It's really quiet and calm Limsa. Not busy at all. Which way do we go? Not that way, you idiot, that way. <sighs> Talking to myself again. They do say that is the first sign of madness, don't they? Bullock Hall, there's the person I need to speak with. Storm Sergeant. The Admiral has been expecting you. Say the word and I will take you to her. Off we go then. I lucked out with him not speaking very much, didn't I? <laughs> nearly crippled my voice doing that. Please do your own voices. Friends, it is good to see you safe and well. I will admit I had not counted on you seeking, let alone finding refuge within the Holy See, but full glad was I to learn that you had. Is this a different voiceover as well? <laughs> Talking to its oneself is a sign of being smart, not madness. I must be a genius, then. I do it all the time. Uh, the others have left, and unfortunately you have to go, grab a bun flux. So, no more party for now. No more party, that's okay. Thank you so much for joining and for um, the uh, the joyous team up that we did earlier while we were out and about. That was really really kind of you. <laughs> Take care. See you another time. Hopefully, maybe maybe on a Thursday, Thursday or a Monday night. Come along again. And we're doing Thursday and Monday nights. I'm going to do Monday and Thursday nights. Even I'm going to do Final Fantasy. So, thank you very much. Um, good night and have a good rest of your day evening whichever it is that you have left rando you always have to look both directions to figure out which way to go from the limpster crystal yeah i've done it so many times and it's nice to know after thousands of hours you have to do so too um <laughs> funky you enjoy talking to myself at least we always agree with each other well you see sometimes i disagree with myself so, you obviously have a good trick there. Uh, Hop, so you've travelled back to your own data centre. I don't even know how you do that. You'll all have to show me one day when I'm less of a sprout. Oh, you'll be there. That'd be lovely to have you back. That'd be great, yeah. Really appreciate the support and the friendship and the company. It's great. Uh, Balthazar, 
Yeah, I've read that there was a big change in the voice acting cast between AR and Heavensward. Well, you know, this is the way it goes. Uh, you know, I, um, yeah. Do you know, once I, um, I feel sorry for whoever it was. Uh, there's, um, <laughs> there's a thing in voice voiceovers called ADR, so it's additional dialogue recording, and that just is done after, uh, programs or, or I suppose or games or whatever any media that needs voices is is done and uh, once I got called in for a, a TV thing to voice uh, to do a voice for somebody else's actual person not a game you know so actually they're their person so they're doing a thing and I guess something must have happened badly with the sound and they couldn't get that person on the day they had the studio to record the voice so they were acting in it and they had my voice for the TV program, it's very weird. Only a short little scene, but um, yeah, things get changed all the time. So you think it's just Aymeric and Orshvall? Well, I'm sure they're all grand, and I can't wait to meet all of them. It'd be weird if you go back and do other bits that I've missed from the ARR though and then hear their voice. But hey, I can deal with it. So anyway, what was the uh, weirdly pronounced, unpronounceable Merlwib saying? She said, friends, it is good to see you safe and well. I will admit I had not counted on you seeking, let alone finding refuge within the Holy See, but full glad was I to learn that you had. Over to you, Millwhip. Thankfully, oh, we had Alpha. allies there who took us under their wing. And theirs was not the only aid we receive, I suspect. When we fled Uldar, we fully expected to become wanted men, known to all and hounded at every turn. Yet that did not come to pass. On the contrary, it would seem the charges against us have not been made public. Might we have you to thank for that, Admiral? Sharp as ever, Master Elfino. On Marshal Terrapin's urging, the Elder Seed Seer and I demanded that the Syndicate suppress news of the Scion's alleged crimes until such time as irrefutable evidence could be found. Our argument was simple. Lacking proof to accuse the saviors of the realm of so unlikely a crime would have the people up in arms. In their wisdom, the Syndicate agreed, as you yourself have seen. There is something you should know. Some few days prior to the banquet, the Elder Seedseer and I were summoned for a private audience with the Sultana. There, she revealed her intent to announce her abdication that she might pave the way for the establishment of an Uldan Republic. I knew I recognised that voice. I've just... <clears throat> I've just um, googled who is voicing this at Melwood now. And lo and behold, it's an actor called Tracy Ann Oberman, who was also on the radio drama company with the BBC with Stephen and I. She joined near like, in the last couple of months that we were there, and I could recognise that voice. And I thought, it's, "That's that's that's Tracy, surely? Yeah, 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 Tracy Ann Oberman. Another person that's done far better at this voiceover acting lark than I have as a career. But then I fell ill twenty years ago with something and sort of dipped out of it all. It is what a coinky dink. Yeah, I like that." A coinky dink it is a small world. I remember Tracy because Tracy <coughs> was in a few. Um, she was quite, quite a well-known actor in the nineties and was doing a few things as an outside um, actor, not part of the company. And she was there, and she, we were doing the few a few series together on the radio. And she said, "How do I get in? How do I get in? I'd love to do this job. I'd love to do six months here. How do I do it?" So I introduced her to the person that sorted it out and she, I don't think it was very difficult for her to get an audition to it. She's got a great voice, she's a good actor. Anyway, let's let her carry on. What? But, but such, such an, an announcement, announcement would have plunged, plunged the entire nation into chaos. 
She was well aware of that. Twas for fear of what might ensue that she summoned us. Her grace wanted the elder Seed Seer and I to lend Raubarn a helping hand, you see? To aid him in preserving the peace during the transition. So, having somehow caught wind of her plan, Lolorito and Teleji plotted the Sultana's assassination in the hope of maintaining the constitutional status quo. But they must have known that her death would sow as much chaos as her abdication. Chaos from which Teleji alone might feasibly stand to profit. Surely Lolorito would never knowingly... <laughs> Indeed. Ah, could it be? I dare not hope. The Uldan authorities have yet to announce the Sultana's passing. Oh. To allay any suspicion that may arise from Her Grace's absence, they have issued a statement to the effect that she is presently convalescing from illness. Oh, have they now? Mayhap they're waiting for a fitting moment to break the news, or mayhap they know of some other reason to delay. Something else has been bothering me, Admiral. I was dismayed to learn that General Raoban is to be executed. Yet upon hearing the news, I could not help but wonder why he had been kept alive for so long. Pray mistake not my meaning. I am, of course, overjoyed that our friend still draws breath, and that he might yet be saved. But if his enemies truly wished to eliminate him, they could have done so immediately. I see no reason for this delay. He's only got one arm. If I remember Aye, rightly. You've struck upon an important point, Master Alphano. Following his capture, Raubarn had been held in the Marasaja pit within Uldar. In recent days, however, he has reportedly been moved to an unknown location. Queerly, it was not the brass blades who spirited him away either, but a band of soldiers decked in blue. Oh, I can't think who that might be. The Crystal Braves. Oh, yes, I can. Oh, see, now that's going to hurt, isn't it? Because I'll for no put them all together. Oh. Aye. If I read the winds are right, the arrangement between Lord Lollorito and the Braves has come under strain. Mm -hmm. At any rate, if we're to rescue Raubarn, we'll have to find him first. And you'll be glad to hear that I have already entrusted the task to those best able to see it done. Our friends of Doma. Mm hmm well, isn't that a treat to hear Tracy too? <laughs> Raban's survival is vital to the Eorzean Alliance. We can ill afford to lose him. But I cannot send troops into old art would spell the end of the Alliance. And war like as not, if there is to be a rescue, it falls to you and yours to attempt it. What a damn surprise. I would not have it any other way, Admiral. It was I who founded the Crystal Braves, and I who must take responsibility for their actions. Spoken like a true leader, Master Alfino. By way of a first step, you should seek out our Doman contact. You will find her among the frontier hands at Revenant's Toll, working in a kitchen. Let's be off then. Seems to be zipping through quite a bit now today. Let's go to Revenant's Toll. Oh, oops. <clears throat> ah, well, look at we doing. I spent 405 gil. I did spend 405 gil teleporting away. Whoa! Who's this? They've got a dragon. That's fancy. Okay. In a kitchen, my lord. Well, hold on a minute. Um, 
It is genius because I can't find them. This is no kitchen. Right. Is there an upstairs bit that I've forgotten about? There's some stairs. <laughs> Thanks, gang. Ta da! What's her name? Higgity. Mistress Lana, I knew in my heart that you were safe, but to see you again in the flesh words cannot well express my relief. Even as the victory feast was taking place, the Crystal Braves turned upon us and took the rising stones by force. Amid the chaos, some few of my compatriots and I were able to slip away unnoticed. That whisking's getting on my nerves. <laughs> yeah, I, know. I just noticed that as well. The busy Lala fell. She's like, mm -hmm. stood on a stool by the thing, just whisking away, making some eggs. I were to slip away unnoticed. Since then, we have remained in Reverence Tull, keeping watch over the mutineers while awaiting your return. You have done well by us, and we Domans do not soon forget our debts. We swear to do all within our power to aid you. Well, thank you very much. Let's get on with it, then. Shortly before you arrived, I received word from Limsa Liminsa that you were searching for General Rabban. As the Admiral will have informed you, he was recently moved from his cell in the Mar Marasaja Pit. At the same juncture, Yuyu Hasi and the third unit were observed leaving the Rising Stones. This can be no simple coincidence. Their purpose, we believe, is to escort the Flame General to the scene of his execution. <laughs> Suffice to say, we have people shadowing the third. If you would join the hunt, pray seek out Daware at Highbridge, where I too am bound. Okay. I can't remember where that is. Let's go see. Where is that? Oh, it's Danalam. High bridge. Uh, oh, okay. Oh, by Drybo. Okay. Bye bye, busy Lalafell. I think Drazan's making a bit of a funny, funny, funny. Oh, I can fly again. The joy. Oh, <laughs> I thought you were making a witty, rude joke, Drazan. Hunberg Longhaft, stroking. The <laughs> well, I, <clears throat> I will obviously have to go searching for the Longhaft. Oh, I've missed him. Where is he? Oh, is this person... Hold on. Is it you? Oh, he's hiding behind here. That's very funny, Dresden. Oh, not you. Duare. I've been expecting you. Time is of the essence, so I shall be direct. You, Yuhasi, and his men are bound for Halatali. We believe that this is where they intend to carry out the execution. Hazan is presently keeping watch over the entrance. Let us make haste and join him. Oh, I've done one of the Moogle delivery side quests from Limpsa. Where did they go? Oh, that way. Um, yeah, I've done one of those. So much to do. Come on. Never mind about you, fate joined. Fate run away from. I love a lot, a lot of the little side quests, but um, see, I'll, I'd never finish the game if I uh, if I only did two streams a week and um, did nothing outside of the streams. Would I? So I think I'll have to do some. Where are they? Where is he? I'll have to do some of those things by myself. But I do want to. I definitely want to do some of the bigger side stuff on on stream. I'd like to do the Dark Knight. I'd, l I'd really love to do the Dark Knight thing on the stream. I think that would be quite good. I've heard it's a great story. 
You come at a good time, my friend, but moments ago the traitor Ilbert arrived and entered Halatali. From this we may be certain that General Rauban is being held within. Well, you'd have to stream, like, 12 hours a day, wouldn't you? Every day to, to just do them all. Or just expect to be playing the game in 2063. Which some of us might! Well, that would be a feat for me, I think, to manage that, but some of you might. Hazan would br what the hell are they? Oh, agate rings of various wonderfulness. Would brief you on the mission to rescue Raban. Go on, brief me. There's no time to lose. General Aldin may be executed at any moment. You must enter Halatali and free him from his captors. I thought it was Rauban. I'm confused. Please see to your preparations and tell me when you're ready to proceed. One of our own will accompany you inside. Okay, let's just go. Beat some people up. Here they are, the Crystal Braves, on the wrong side of the law. Hello? Pray, forgive me my lateness. Lady Ugiri! Master Alphano, I am pleased to see that the light of resolve shines in your eyes once more. Ah, yes. yes. How, How pathetic, pathetic I must have seemed to you when we last met. I am ashamed to record it. For a time I was well and truly lost. But with the aid of my comrades, I have since refound my purpose and I shall take care not to misplace it again. Since your escape from Ulda, my fellow Shinobi and I have shadowed the Crystal Braves every step in hopes of learning the Scion's whereabouts. Regrettably, our investigation has yet to yield any useful information. Pray, forgive us. You need not apologize, my lady. We are grateful for all that you have done on our behalf. Besides, Ralban is no less a friend, and we cannot well abandon him to his fate. Hazan, the three of us shall attend to the Flame General's rescue. Pray, draw away the guards by the entrance. Take Doware and Higiri with you. Oh, fancy. Fancy me. Oh. With me. She said that with some haste and we just sort of slowly pan away. Take the lead, Lana, and I shall follow close upon you. Yes, you will. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Kindly healing me there. That's them too. Done. Yes, with me. Stand slowly and. <laughs> Walks away. It's just the kind of universal ending to anything, isn't it? The characters 
always just slowly walk away when you're meant to be following them and then they disappear it's the convention they've gone for it works leave this to me oh. all right go on then i'll leave it to you oh. so the crystal break conjurer what was that you did then you giddy it's weird it's a bit like doing one of the dungeon things but yeah without a party uh, is this a dead end looks like a dead end Oh, what's that? The Roban. I do not like the look of this. No, me neither. We did come. Uh, oh, hello. He's bound by some manner of magitech device, yet I dare not force it open. It may well be booby-trapped. Swines! I have heard of such devices. The crystal braves will possess the key. Let us split up and look for it. Oh, I've got to do it on my own. But who will heal me? That will not be necessary, says the question mark. Yuyahasi, pray do not take it personally, my friends. You are the victim of this lot of you are the victims of harsh economic conditions. Happily you will not suffer for long. This poison will convey you swiftly unto the bosom of Tha, where I hope to join you after the passing of many prosperous years. Indeed. Get him! The fight's on. The fight is on. Where are they? The fight's on somewhere. Where? Where is he? Oh, there. Hello. Maybe that thing will just disappear when we get rid of them. Maybe not. A cerbic jam. <laughs> Pray to the mist and the key. The braves have the key. Where? What? You'll tend to the general. The mists and the key. I'll go go this way. Destroy the source of the mist. Okay, let's go that way. Rauban's vitality is pretty shit. I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Am I completely going the wrong way again? I fear I'm going the wrong way. Oh no, hold on. There's about to be. Oh, we've got to go past these peeps. Okay.
Thank you, Physic. Where? 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 This way? I feel like I'm going out. I'm trying to go out. Hall of the Provocators. This feels wrong. I guess it's not wrong. Next to found the key. Yeah, next to find the key. Where the hell is that? Okay, that's not there. This way, maybe? Oh, they look like people I've got to beat up. Help if I was on the right person, wouldn't it? <laughs> Get the crystal brave archer, we need the key. Oh, his vitality's gone up a lot. No, my barn's by comes up to 80. That's damn good. There's the key. Take it to the barn. Back we go. Think I'm going the right way. Um, yeah, around here. Oh, there are people waiting to get me again now. I've just miraculously appeared. Not yet. Can't jump over there. All right, fair enough. We'll get there. Hmm. There's a little chirruping thing in the background there. At least I hope it was in the game. <laughs> Magitech device interacting. Oh, 
Oh, his poor arm. Look at him. My my thanks. <coughs> Slowly, General, you are yet weak from your ordeal. Nevertheless, we must quit this place. I should have known what are clever contrivances to the warrior of light. Well done, hero. Oh, I forgot to get these three now. Ilbert. <coughs> You mean to struggle on there very well. If you would stand in my way, I will cut you down like all the rest. Somehow, I don't think that's our plan. Let's see what we can do. This have got my buddies with me now. Oh, hello. Oh, you do if I keep pressing the wrong button. It is nothing. They're not finished yet. They're not finished yet, okay. Oh, they've got a healer somewhere, I can't see. Oh, they have, they've got this conjurer. I'll tear you limb from limb! I swear that sounds like an actor called Jared McDermott. That would be too uncanny if Jared was that little voice over there. If he's playing Ilved, that would be weird. For and it, amigo! Poison you. Aha! Tronk. They have decided that Alamegans have all the next one. changes nothing. I've got to look. Who is, is it? If that, that's weird. Voice actor. I've got to check. I've got to check. Voice actor. Ilbert. Final Fantasy fourteen. Oh, Anthony Byrne. Oh. oh, and then somebody called Richard Epcar. So it must be... There's two people who've done his voice. Neither of them happened to be somebody called Jared McDermott. That would have been too much of a coincidence. Because he was on the rep too with us. Okay. It is over, Elbert. Lay down your arms and surrender yourself to justice. That's right. Justice? Justice for what exactly? Twas not I who assassinated the Sultana, boy. Ere we debate who is responsible for the assassination, I would ask whether an assassination took place at all. Richard Epcar was in the first... Ah, okay, the first instalment. So this would be whoever I said the other person's name was, and now I've closed the page now. Oh, clever little shite. <laughs> clever little shite. If you think you fight for justice, lass, you best wake up. The truth is, you fight for whoever bloody well tells you to. Can you not see you're being used by the Scions, the city-states, even the Crystal Braves? They none of them care a whip what you want, only what you can do for them. God, it sounds so much like... Uh... 
And how do I know this? Because I'm the same. A pawn to be used as my master's see fit. All I ever wanted was to liberate my homeland. And I ate dirt to make it happen. But what have I achieved after all these years in servitude? Nothing. Not a bloody thing. If we ourselves are not free, free to think and to act, how are we ever to reclaim our own land? Know this. There is nothing I would not give to take back Alamigo. Nothing! Oh. Fancy flashing light getaway trick. You'll not get away. I think he is. No, Master Alphano. Now is not the time. Oh dear. Stopped. Back in your box, Alphano. I'm but a cripple and a fool. And still you came for me. I'm in your debt. Well, it's like a it's a much richer sort of less harsh voice, isn't it, than the previous actors? Just is a different take on it, isn't it? This voice actors for our barn. We are all of us fools of fate, General. But even fools have a part to play. Yeah, inspirational he needs. On your feet, Gladiator, the fight is still to come. Rest assured, I was not planning to die till it avenged the Sultana. Still, your words are welcome, lass. Know this, Ilbert. There is nothing I would not give to see you pay for what you've done. My wealth. My arm, my life, nothing. General, are you aware that Lord Lollarito has yet to announce the Sultana's death to the public? Shocking, but true. What? No. No, I was not aware of that, nor of anything else outside my cell. It is passing strange, though. I assume the bastard would make it known at the first opportunity, and set about tearing down the Sultanate. As did we all, and it is indeed strange that he did not. Strange, or perhaps revealing. Now, I have no conclusive proof, nor do I wish to give you false hope, but I have reason to believe that her grace may yet to live. What? What? Oh. How can that be? <laughs> My thoughts exactly. <laughs> Oh, Hopsu, you're not feeling very well, are you? Oh dear. I hope you can get some sleep too. What time is it where you are? Have you got is it bedtime now? I hope you get some rest. Forgive me, friends, but it is not safe here. Let us continue this conversation without Without what? No, I know what you mean. Without yeah, well, you get well soon. You got some, lots of hot drinks, I hope, and um, it's twelve thirty-five a.m. That sounds like sleep time to me. <laughs> I'm sure Funky that that Hobson knows. Yeah, we're all kind to each other here. It's good. Yeah, um, 12.35 sounds like sleep time to me. That's uh, two hours ahead of you, so you're two hours ahead of me. So you're probably, yeah. <coughs> you need some sleep, you need some sleep. This is why I don't text my friend that's in Finland after about nine o'clock at night. <laughs> so they're two hours ahead of me there. I'm going to forget that I forgot when he first moved. It's 
rubbish being ill, isn't it? I hate it. You live in Finland? Ah, oh, well, don't tell us any more because you know privacy and all of that. But um, I hear it's rather brilliant. My friend moved out there. I saw that there's a, a little. Me I've just seen that there's a message. I think I didn't know it's from you both, so I'll have a look after. Uh, what have you? What have you got? Yeah, guy, I like a hot toddy. Yeah, I don't know. <coughs> yeah, I don't know if you like hot toddies or whether you're of the age for such things. But um, yeah, some nice lemon and some whiskey and some hot water and uh, honey is fantastic. Yeah, hot soup. So a hot toddy um, is well for me. I don't know. Um, what Balthazar thinks, but uh, for me it's like hot water, whiskey, or uh, yeah, whiskey, or brandy, I suppose. Uh, but normally whiskey, some lemon juice, and some honey, and you know it's like more fun than a hot chemist drink to get rid of your flu, and it's really good. I like them. Somebody said something I missed about the voice acting. Did I miss that? Where's that gone? You whispered a site that may help keep up with the voice acting changes. I hope it proves helpful. Oh, thank you, Balthazar. That's what you, you've sent in the message. I really appreciate that. Um, it is a bit confusing, just like listening to the voices differently. But I also, because I'm interested in the field of voiceovers, obviously, in voice acting, it'd be nice to see who the voiceovers are and you know, um, and, um, you know, maybe, maybe say hello to them sometime on, on the internet and say thanks. Isn't that funny how uh, people are in so many different places all watching me do this thing and stream through the game? Yeah, I think, you know, I might join, I could join you. I haven't got, I, I've got these uh, lemon and ginger tea bags which I've used lately and put some, uh, done a sort of a bit eastern ooh garky a bit of a, a eastern european thing of putting like um, a lime conserve like a lime marmalade in there instead of the honey i had that with whiskey and lemonade not lemonade <laughs> whiskey and lemonade whiskey and hot water don't use lemonade that's a stupid idea <laughs> blackberry and zinc hot drinks those are good no alcoholic stuff good so hot tod toddy's out of the list well you can still do it without i mean you know hot water lemon and honey is great the whiskey is optional like yeah exactly the whiskey is optional well it would have to be for obviously for hops so yeah so you know hot water lemon and honey is brilliant um what have we got left how much time have i got trying to be sensible because I can play games for hours and hours and hours obviously I've been here for nearly four but trying to be sensible because uh, like last week I could have I could have played for hours and kept chatting with you all but um, I got 20 more minutes let's do a little bit more and then we'll come back and carry on on Thursday lemon ginger tea and honey yes yes I've got some lemon and ginger tea bags and honey in the cupboard. I can have one of those afterwards, Hopter. I think that's a great idea. Um, oh, do you know, I wonder if I'm going to say, let me have a little look. My friend sent me a thing. He isn't Finnish, but he's moved there. Um, I won't tell his life story because it's a bit rude, isn't it, of me? Oh, I'm not going to be able to find it. I'll find it another time. I will find my Finnish thing. Little Finnish words. and um, You could watch for hours and hours and hours. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm beginning to realise that you could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but uh, <coughs> maybe <coughs> when I've got a better setup, because obviously I didn't expect to... I didn't even expect to be doing this. I've just been sat on my sofa playing the game for the, you know, the last month up until... We had the vigil last week, and um, <coughs> excuse me, dry throat. Have a little bit of water. 
and obviously I don't have a PC or anything to stream from properly and it's not particularly comfortable uh, sitting in the way I have been sitting on the sofa so that my stupid old eyes can see what the text is saying on the screen and uh, checking the chat out and everything so I'm I'm making the best of my uh, the equipment that I've got to do it and I'm enjoying myself but perhaps you know if I carry on well you know, if things well I'm obviously going to keep doing this aren't I definitely got to keep doing Final Fantasy I've got to keep doing the whole story posture is important yeah um, so my wife was saying you're going to have to get a proper chair I'm like yeah okay one day one thing at a time I think maybe the chair is probably more important than getting a, a, anything else set up so that I can uh, I'm doing Hella Foyne I'm, I'm not going to say that properly am I so that is uh, a finish for an excuse for furniture shopping. Oh, well, I do like shopping. I don't particularly like clothes shopping. Uh, well, I haven't lately because of um, uh, I've I've put on lots of weight over the last five or six years while I've been ill. Um, but um, I would like to get back into that. Got a good plan though for my weight. As I say, I'm. I'm in my early 50s now and I've got a few stone to lose so that I can stay healthy and stay alive for a lot longer. Um <clears throat> so yeah, I might get into might get into uh, some clothes shopping. We've got to stay alive, haven't we? We've got to enjoy ourselves. I mean, enjoying ourselves, see, enjoying ourselves doesn't just have to be about eating indulgent food although I have done that I've, I've eaten quite nicely today I've been very sensible my wife's started helping me with the diet because she knows how to work it all all right let's get back to doing this last little bit of some quest shall we do do this last little thing see what we get on and say our oh god nights wish hops are very well so that they get better I want you to get better soon posture and ergonomics are number one the general is safe. What news without? Balance, yeah. I haven't had balance, Dresden, for a long time. I've been not doing very well. So, I've got to get myself together. Was that, Hopsa, you last summer you bought yourself a proper office chair and that is good. Yeah, I bet it is. It's not good sitting on the sofa, especially not sitting as I am now on the edge of my sofa so I can read everything. <laughs> So I think, yeah, the the chair would have to be one of the first things I try and save up for, I think. My lady, the guards have been subdued as per your command. We have since kept watch over the entrance. There has been no further activity. Then Ilbert and his minions have fled via some other egress. Scour the perimeter for signs of their passing. You've still got a lack of uh, of balance. Yeah. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, that that hit me. COVID, the, the two years of COVID uh, being, you know, all the lockdowns and everything that we had, uh, well, that we had in the UK, I, I can't, you know, I mean, uh, different situations, but a lot of lockdowns everywhere around the world, weren't there? Um, kind of threw us, but I was... I was in a bad way health wise mental health wise before that and uh and it and it meant my physical health got very bad and I started getting these seizures and that was pretty awful um but yeah then just like cooped up you don't go out and then you eat badly and my eating habits got they were not balanced doubt drazan they were not balanced so uh yeah so I've put on quite a lot of weight over the last 3 years and uh, yeah, I don't want to do that. My father had a heart attack at the age of 50 something. He lived for another 20 years. He had a few more heart attacks. But, um, you know, I, I, don't, I don't want to go that way. I want to be healthier. Poor Stephen, of course. Um, Stephen Critchlow, he had a stroke like 18 months or a little bit longer before. I can't remember the timing exactly. I think it was January of the year before. 
and then recovered from that and then of course got cancer but um which is different obviously but yeah you've got to keep yourself healthy so we don't we don't get a stroke we keep going and we can keep playing final fantasy and keep talking to each other that's what we've got to do what's yugiri saying then Ilbert and his minions have fled via some other egress scour the perimeter for signs of their passing that's it at once my lady I love playing games why would I not want to keep doing it obviously I love my wife and my daughter and my family too and all you lot now you're all important to me now that's it you're my final fantasy family now who did somebody say you, I'm your final fantasy uncle yeah I like that I'll be your uncle General Aldin I presume and the scions of the seventh dawn hello dark stranger is my bow who are you identify yourself pray do not be alarmed my mistress is a friend and I come bearing a message of good will for your own safely safely for your own safety oh bless you all for your own safety she bade me direct your steps to the walking sands Do you know when I was born I was already a, technically an uncle because I had two stepsisters that were much older than I from my father's first marriage so yeah they'd got kids and I was technically an uncle when I was born so yes <clears throat> Rob the uncle poet of Final Fantasy um, for your own safety she bade me direct your steps to the waking sands know that master Uriange waits you there along with others sympathetic to your cause have been there for ages this is no ruse I assure you General Alden if you will come with me I have prepared a carriage that you may travel in comfort safe from prying eyes okay are we going do we believe them nods around nod 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 rubber nod yeah hold it nod nod yeah off we go oh look at him with his only one arm bless him getting that chopped off in that massive bloody thing massive end to ARR we don't go in that what are we doing half an hour we're going I've spoken with your Angers via link pearl he confirms the man's story handy Raban is in safe hands let us make our own way to Vesper Bay I've still got some of these tickets. Ba -ba -ba. Remove one from my saddlebag. Oops. Da -da 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 -da. Let us go. Funnily enough, I kept using the. <laughs> I kept travelling to the camp east of here. And spending my gill on travelling before I realised what these were for. Those special travel tickets. I also kept following people in here and wondering what they were doing. Before I was actually at that part of the game. Enter the Waking Sands. My dearest friends, praise be unto the Twelve for delivering you from the clutches of treachery. I'm in the Cool Kids Club too. Well, it seems like it. I've never been a cool kid. But I feel like it. Pippin! I feel like it now. My son! And Master Papachan besides! He sounds a bit like the actor Sean Bean, doesn't he? I should, I should have been, have been at her grace's, grace's side. side. Save your tears. The Sultana yet lives. You. It was I who arranged this gathering. And judging by your perplexed expressions, it would seem introductions are in order. I am Dulala, head of the Order of Noldthor, and member of the Syndicate. One second, folks. 
my wife's just come in and mouthed something to me which I didn't understand. <laughs> but she doesn't want to be heard on the thing, so she's shaking her head at me. <laughs> I'll be finished soon, darling. <laughs> They've all been very lovely and um, very, 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 yeah, well, very lovely. And we've heard Stephen's voice this evening. It's been great. She's still not going to speak while I've got the microphone on. Julala. So we've got Julala. What you said about the Sultana. Is it true? Is she alive? Doesn't he sound like Sean Bean? It's not, though. Young lady, I understand you were with the Sultana when she drank from the poisoned goblet and collapsed. Would I be correct in assuming that you did not personally verify Her Grace's vital signs? He sings a lot of songs in this expansion, so that's great. Well, I should look forward to that. Got lots to look forward to. Why ask when he's playing? You know the answer. Hopsu says, please let your wife know that we love her too. Hopsu, Hopsu is in Finland. They're not very well. Yeah, so we're sending them all our love as well. With this plane, you know the answer. The plight of a gamer's wife. There's um. <laughs> there was that little cartoon I saw recently, which said, uh, "I didn't marry a gamer," and I thought, "No, my wife didn't, but she didn't know that." They say, "Thanks for lending us your husband." She's laughing in her grey haired way. Green haired way, I meant to say. She looked at me you know, the other day. She was saying, so, um, it's your birthday soon. You're going to be 54, aren't you, darling? I was like, no. I am not going to be 54 yet. I will be 52. Cheek. <laughs> Why ask then? Tis plain you know the answer, says Rabam. Oh, it's Calm yourself, bit. General, General, and let, let me finish. finish. The, the truth, truth is not <laughs> as you imagine it. You are you all are victims of a most ingenious ruse. ruse. A ruse conceived to eliminate the threat posed by Telechi Adelechi. Telechi Adelechi, what a rusing swine they were. You're both a gamer and a gamer's wife. I wish I had green hair, though. Hey. I it is possible. It can it be done. It is my belief that Telegi plotted the Sultana's assassination alone, but that Lollarito caught wind of his plot and exploited it to his own ends. Oh, Lollarito's a dastardly swine, too. He sought to manipulate you into eliminating Telegi for him, and you duly obliged. Indeed. At one fell swoop, he removed his two foremost rivals, all the while remaining above suspicion. God strike me down for a fool. But the Sultana, how can it be that she lives? My wife doesn't play games. She gets very confused with them. We've tried. She lives because Lollarito willed it. Her own lady-in-waiting is but one of his many little birds. By her sleight of hand, the poison was switched for a less deadly draught before it could reach her mistress's lips. My daughter plays quite a few games, but isn't playing very much at the moment. Life has Some taken over. Some of sedative, perchance, of a potency sufficient to induce a slumber like unto death. Yeah, she's it. My wife, <laughs> my wife's watched me play a little bit of the Disney Dreamlight Valley. There's no way she's going to play it though. <laughs> she might watch me play. Maybe she'll sit with me and play while I play some of it tomorrow afternoon on stream at two p.m. UK time. He said, plugging his stream for tomorrow. Um, Were I to guess, I would say her grace is being held somewhere. Dreaming dreams of a brighter Ulda, even as we speak. Oh, none more. 
Nanama. Oh, I know, it was so moving. With the, he thought she died, obviously. She th we thought she died. I thought she died. I will died. never forgive Lolorito for his part in this. This is weird. Though Lolorito's hands are far from clean, they did pluck her grace from the jaws of death. That must count for something. It counts for confusing me. And though one may call the man's methods into question, it cannot be denied that he knows the value of stability to the very gill, like as not. He craves power, tis true, but he has no desire to depose the Sultana. I had never taken sides in your feud with the monetarists, but it was not for want of concern for our nation's welfare. Indeed, t'was out of the desire to see order restored that I furnished your Far Eastern friends with information and arranged this gathering. Yes, I've arranged that gathering that Rando's reminding you all of at 2pm tomorrow, he said, stream pluggingly. <laughs> Oh, there's going to be a little bit of noise now while my wife makes her smoothie in her noisy smoothie machine. I don't know how much noise. How long? Go on, go. Do. <laughs> well, you've got to plug your own channel on your own channel, huh? I guess. <laughs> I would do it. I'll figure out how to do it better I at some point. I hope you are ready to work, General, for there is much work to be done. Our first priority must be to bring matters back into balance. Lest you forget Her Grace's words, the true wealth of Uldar lies in the health, happiness, and hopes of her people. As for the more worldly kind of wealth, I am content to let Lolorito help himself to whatever Teleggi Adeleggi left behind. Oh. You, meanwhile, must do that which you alone can do. Rescue her grace and take your place at her side once more, for her sake and that of our nation. Wow. Is that the end of that little bit? Well, crikey. Well, let's just speak to Alpha now and finish this little checkpoint off. I had not counted on Prioress Julala's her herself appearing. In my defence, my suspicions regarding the Sultana proved more prescient. Much remains to be done, but in rescuing Raban, we have taken a vital first step towards resolving matters in Uldar. We couldn't have done it without you, Lana. Thank you. Oh, it's got to be the f aiming, isn't there? Yes, a ring of aiming. What's that compare to what other one? Uh, well, it's not a huge boost, but at least I can meld something. Ta-da-da! Right, well, that seems like a good place to stop for this evening, I think. Yes, I said four hours. It's dead on 11 o'clock here for me. Woohoo! Well done, sir, well done. Well, thank you, well done. <laughs> We've got through quite a bit, haven't we, this evening? He says, if I had a list of all the quests line, I'd be like, yes, and now you have 4,723 to go <laughs> before you get to part two of Heaven's Ward. Thank you all so much. Thank you, Hopsu. Thank you, Hopsu. Thank you. I hope you feel better very soon. Please do let me know when you're feeling better. I um, I don't like it to, to think you're poorly. Um... If it's okay with you, can I ask some people in the FF14 streaming community for some assistance in getting you set up with a full game. <sighs> that that's really kind of you. I yeah, I'd be honored to I'd be honored. That would be really lovely. Um my as I said my situation is weird because I've started playing this and gotten well over 250 hours now on PlayStation 4. 
on a Canadian account and I have my PlayStation account linked to my UK Square Enix account I don't know how that works so I'm really scared to kind of you know uh, obviously I was scared to spend money I don't really have on buying something and then screwing it up I was going to try last week before the stream to see if I could spend money I shouldn't on doing it and then I thought no after screwing things up with the microphone I <laughs> and having a whole hour in my test where I wasn't actually heard on my microphone I thought I didn't want to miss out and not be there for the vigil for Steven so <sighs> Funky that's so darn kind of you I really appreciate it um, that that's really lovely um, I don't know how any of that works gift cards and anything on the place I have no idea um, that's yeah you yeah very lovely very lovely indeed very you're all very lovely of you all for being here i'm gonna put in my little can i will it come yeah i've loved every minute of it thank you so much Rando, don't worry. Yeah, thanks. For, thanks for coming along, Balthazar. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure to have you here, and thank you. Yeah, they, they thank you and your family for your time. Um, it's just me and my wife who live here now. My daughter's moved out, but um, yeah, she was gonna. We wanted to, her to come around and see us this week, and I said, don't, don't come Monday. I'm streaming Monday night. <laughs> uh, she wouldn't have been able to come anyway because, like Hop said, they've got a terrible cold so um they need to stay in bed hopefully they've had some hot lemon oh yeah i've got to do that now that was the plan lemon and ginger tea um thank you so much drazan thank you everyone for being here it's been an absolute pleasure once again um just to just to spend this evening with you all and you know maybe catch you all thank you funky for is it funky with just the F with a, with a silent F or should we say funky? I keep trying to say all the letters. Silent F? Not a silent F, a silent H. <laughs> Thank you for the stream. Thanks everybody for coming. Um, it's just funky. You funky with a big double bass strap to you. Um, pleasure is mine, Random. Thank you thank you so much see you all another time and you know as the weeks go by let's see if I, i'll see if i can get set up with a chair and maybe get a camera so as you say you can see the uh uh see my my reactions to the stream as so they are uh yes monty python i love monty python right well i could talk to you all all evening and all into the morning i'm sure but let's do this again on another day as i say i'm going to be on tomorrow afternoon doing uh dreamlight valley i think if anyone turns up i'll be there doing it um but we'll be back doing um let's get come back to do some more of this quest line i'll probably do some other things between now and then obviously but this quest line we will carry on with alphano from here on Thursday at 7 p.m. UK time. Love to you all. I've had a great, great time here with you. Thank you so very, very much indeed. Um, and good night. Good night, everybody. Bye bye. Take care of yourselves. Good night. <laughs>